what, what, what Lady them are doing in LA with the brown bag. Brown bag, brown bag is the best in here, brown bag pie. Back. Damn, that means our live show is gonna be 120. I didn't even realize oh, that yeah. lined up like that. We 120. Said last week that after the live show we're gonna do our break after. Oh yeah, because yeah, no, 30. I, I knew that, Absolutely. but that's dope. Yeah. It worked well, out no, perfectly because like all in synchronicity, brother. Yeah, all in synchronicity. It's meant to be. All right, we gotta do Sombra Sala, Angelica. We what's do, you guys, because I have great, great news. Because a lot of girls are happy. Me too. I'm happy. I'm a lot of girls. The cheese is so hot. We I'm moved to the A block. You are a lot of girls. I'm a lot of girls. <laughs> <laughs> we're all a lot of girls. Yes. Because Kendall and Bad Bunny. Are no longer together. Yeah. Oh wow. Yes. yes. I think we have Benito back. Yes. I feel yeah. Like it's Me and Bad right? Bunny gonna be outside next summer. Yeah. The hate is real. That hate, you know, you know, you know what's real? The music that's coming out. Hey. That's, that's what's real. That's what I'm talking about. That's what Vic was saying, but I don't know. I mean, he just dropped the album. I know, but album like 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 I'll okay, get look. I'm I'm all for him. Forget about that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Let's just forget it. <laughs> Leave that in 2023. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Look, 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 man. I'm all for him. Wanted to be a rapper and I'm better than everybody. That's cool. We already know. You don't have to. What what's already known doesn't have to be said. That's what Juan Gabriel said when asked me if it was gay. Yeah. I learned that a long time ago. <laughs> that's right. Yeah. That's why that for my mom. I asked my mom, "Is Juan Gabriel gay?" And she looked me in the eyes as a young boy and said, mm-hmm. "Lo que se sabe no se pregunta." Mm-hmm. And Bad Bunny, we already know you're the best. We get it. We do. We you're, do. You're the, so We're now that you left the white girl, the white devil. We need you back. Okay. Well, I, don't, I don't know about the white devil, yeah. but it's just yeah. like the bad juju. I don't know. Like candle. That's it. It's like candle, you guys. I think it's just like, it's it's consuming, you know, whenever you're like in such a public relationship and stuff like that. And then you she has she to. You think she was distracting? That's what you're saying? Sure. Both of them are distracting each other in a way. It's like. I mean, I don't. What does she do? Okay. She, she Kendall, models? Ken, Kendall things. I don't know. But like, imagine, like she has to do like appearances models. and models. And like, so imagine like she's out in Paris. He's out in, you know, wherever. And then it's like they're missing each other. Like, and then sometimes they try to maybe line up their own like trips together so they see each other. I think they did that over yeah. the summer. Yeah. When so I it's like hoping. just consuming. Like, yeah. it so takes time and energy and effort. Girlfriend? Yeah. yeah. I don't think he's gonna. It's not like you can't just like tell your girl like when he dated the other girl like, hey, this is where we're going. Almost mamita. You know. Her schedule yeah. is his schedule. Exactly. Yes. Mm-hmm. That's how I feel about the girls. I'm not dating nobody in the industry like Vic. Yeah. You feel me? Because I want my schedule to be her schedule. Yeah. Not. Vic's not dating anyone in the industry. Yeah, I'm not. Yeah. Oh, he's but, not. but usually he did. He, it was a, he dates regulars. Yeah. Whoa. And cousins. And cousins. <laughs> cousins. <laughs> First of all, let's just cheers to Benito. Cheers. 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 Yeah. Yeah. Cheers. Shout out to Letty and Vic for getting these boots. Shout out Letty for getting these boots. This is so cool. Yeah. This is La Bota. La Bota. <laughs> La Cruz <Christian laughs> Bota. Oh, oh, oh. What's, yeah. what's in the Zibuts? Um, Don't uh, ask no question. What's the uh, Juan Gabriel line? Lo que se sabe no se pregunta. Es yes, de... Maximo, come no on. Se, keep up, keep up. Lo que se sabe no se pregunta. Oh, sorry, sorry, sorry. Lo que se sabe no se pregunta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They haven't paid yeah. for that yet. Yeah, they haven't paid for that yet. <laughs> <laughs> hey, by the way, these are already smacking. Maybe... <laughs> did you eat at all? Yeah. I did actually eat a torta de huevo with my mom this morning while we bonded them over, mm-hmm. over family cheese man. Shout out to who just man. came? Uh, who was Naturales? Who was Naturales? Yeah. Okay, so they came last time. And last time they came, they brought their mom. And their mom only spoke Spanish. So we were talking like, oh, buenos dias. Like, muchas gracias. Like, good morning. And so today they brought somebody else. And I think all of our minds went to, not that she looks like a mom. But no. like that the girl they bring speaks Spanish only. Mm-hmm. So we all were speaking to her in Spanish. And she's like, nice to meet you. Like she was younger. Yeah, she's, she's a sister. Yeah. 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 <laughs> yep. Don't worry. Um, it happens to me all and, the time. And then Duno felt racist. <laughs> I felt racist. How? For <laughs> speaking to her in Spanish. I feel like a Karen. Uh, I just assumed. Oh, oh, like, oh, oh, I, I, yeah, but I just assumed she only spoke Spanish. Yeah, wow, that was fucked up. Just because she's wearing an apron? Yeah, she's wearing an apron. I was like, oh, it's just she like my mom. Christmas out. I know, I know, but she was just giving me like super Tia, tia mom vibes. And I'm not, I mean, she's probably an older sister, which I assume yeah. she is because they they like followed in line with her. Yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Like she was running. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So, like, but yes, yeah, so I said, I said, I was like, she gave you the vibes of she doesn't know where. Her her brothers are taking her, but yeah, yeah she's here. But yeah. I was like, but I was Pero like, quieren tortas. but I was like, <laughs> yeah. but I was like, hola, buenos días. And she's like, hi, good morning. And yeah. I was like, <laughs> you know, what? I wonder if she gets that a lot. And shout out to you guys again, who was naturalist for They're coming amazing. through. They're yeah. 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 so good. Make sure you guys go tap in. I go all the time, a little bit. And so sorry. Good. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, sorry for being. Shout out Sergio. Shout out the whole family. Yeah. Sorry, even sorry. the ones that speak English, English. and English. Well, it's Spanish. okay, guys. I was at Trader Joe's and they thought I worked there. No way. Yeah, you? for no reason. I'm like, bro, I don't even. No, amigo, never... amigo. I'm not can even you please wearing red, here, bro. Amigo. <laughs> yeah. How about name badge, bro? <laughs> but okay. the fruits are over there. 
<laughs> but, but actually, I can't go in the back and see if we still have that. <laughs> yeah, so I definitely, I definitely feel hella racist. Mm-hmm. But you know who no longer feels racist? Who? Kendall, because he's single. Hey. Yeah. You or know. is that more racist because she broke up with him? She left that fool because he was speaking too much Spanish. Well, you don't know why she left him or who broke up. Who with broke who? up? Oh, with okay. Because they haven't let's, made a statement. Let's theorize. Let's theorize. Who broke up with who? Who sent the text? Because it happened after the SNL performance, yeah, right? That Andy? was the last time they Did were together. Did they see each other and, and have the in person breakup or was it like? Who a, knows? I'm saying because let's this is like what sources are saying. If you had Did to, her assistant tell his assistant? Mm. Yeah, that's that's a. Oh. Is his assistant? Gabriela. <laughs> did oh. did, did uh, Kendall find out yeah. through the 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 um Google? What's up? The, Google? Yeah, the Twitter link like we did. It's like oh, uh, Kendall and Bad Bunny yeah, have broken up. We're <gasps> broken up. Yeah. What? I didn't know that. <laughs> Damn, that's crazy. If you think Kendall goes on like the family group chat and cheese me out about Bad Bunny. For sure. Yes. You know when we're gonna find out about all these answers? Oh. Next season of the Kardashians. 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 Oh, what a cliffhanger. <laughs> yeah. It's gonna drop like next summer, but then we will know. Yeah. I know. And well, we'll be talking about it again. Mm-hmm. Damn. Kendall went through his WhatsApp. Oh, uh, and that fool was sending I mean, nudes. She to wouldn't the PR. be able to read it. <laughs> you see what? You, you think he was doing dirt? No, you know what it was. You know what it was. What? She was washing that fool's pants, and yeah. then she went through his pockets, and then she found a receipt of that for sending money to PR to like a, a less fortunate baddie that lives in the slums over there. Shout out, Bad Bunny, and and, yeah, and, and, and yeah. Kendall. But the I'm excited because because you know what yeah. I want. What? I want another album. Like um, is, I'm gonna say I might say it wrong. Oasis, Oasis, Oasis. Yes, you need to if he can well, ever he catch get, it up with J Balvin. Yeah, he has to get back like cool with that. With I need to listen to Oasis that album in full. They never even toured yeah. it, man. No, just they never. It was, it was, it was like a small oh, EP, no? Did. They gotta make make up and tour. Bro, that yeah, shit was a, that shit was a small EP, but that's they initially hit. what Every what kind of took over the world. It was like it was like the small EP that. Everybody slept on it and then when Bad Bunny really blew up, they went back to it and that became like... Oh, I, didn't, I didn't sleep on it. Yeah, but Angie, you're like a rare beaner, you know? Angie's been knowing it. Yeah. If you know put me on that song? Who? My ex what one time. La Cancion? La Cancion. Was that like the... We're not even... How many minutes are we into the podcast? Oh my God. How many minutes? Just how many minutes? Nine. Nine minutes. And you already mentioned two different girls. You mentioned uh, no celebrity girls. That's why your girl's not a celebrity. And then you missed your ex. No, I was talking about Vic... But why does Duno want to talk about Anita in Peso Pluma? The, oh, the, super, cow, the, cow, the, cow, the super cheese man of all time. Okay. Oh. So Peso Pluma is with oh, Nicky Nicole. Nicole. Okay. So they had a they had so they had a performance at the TikTok thing. Mm, and no way. Wait, let me finish. Let me finish. In Arizona. Hold on, I'm doing the theater thing. <gasps> The novela, what? No okay, 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 go, go, go. So they had to perform, but so this is how Pedro Bluma usually performs, yeah, right? Right. This is him with he's Anita, very, like, yeah. and and he's scary. He was scared for sure. He was and scared. He, for he, he like that. No, look no, what no, she's no. wearing. No, but Anita's yeah. ready to get oh. it cracking. Yeah, of course. Oh. Look at her. Look at her. Anita's fine as fuck. She's That's bad. Look at her. He's all but, but he like. But he like. You can tell. I'm gonna jump. It's Miss Bestie West. I me too. Uh, I mean, that came out of nowhere. I can't and, hear it. It's funnier. Go follow Irene right now. Go and, follow Irene. You know what's funny that I follow Irene, <laughs> so her algorithm always comes out, and I'll be like, yeah, her, her Irene, why? Are you in the elevator again? Yeah. It's, <laughs> it's a oh, working. It's a series. A so this is a trend right now on TikTok where like everybody's like, what would I would have done if, if Anita was next to me? And there's like boyfriends like pushing the girl out the way yeah. and like all types Doing of fun. Doing the most. Doing yeah. the most. Nita? It's not wrong though. And then Anita, I get it. Like she she dances like that and she That's her brand. That's her I know. Thing. That's I know. her thing. Like I know, I know. And but Peso Pluma, I don't think he did anything wrong. Like he was being respectful, you yeah. know? But look, but look, this is the turn now, look. Look at Nikki tenía que hacer like, <laughs> so like, like, so then it's like, <laughs> <laughs> so that's like the, but all the Latinas are like, yeah, that's oh, like, no, it's a guy, yeah, that's so, a girl. so that's like the trend now, like, like, yeah, like, people reacting, yeah, like, to like, what, like what they would do, yeah, yeah. So, I'm, done. so this is my thing, right? I get it, right? They're performers, yeah, and she's a great performer. I need to, obviously, that was yeah, the first amazing. time I read it, incredible, she's a, but Pedro Pluma should have just been like, yeah, he no. should have leaned into it. Yeah, I think, I think it was more that he just, he was so used to him doing the like. Yeah, and his hair and everywhere. More. Yeah, 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 and then he was just a little more Do like, like robot out. Was it just that one song with Anita? That he yeah, yeah, because yeah. he had like a whole. Per- he was the main. It's crazy that he went. He went above. 
Yeah, everybody like, Cardi, like I, think, all of I think there was like a, no. a I think Charlie no, Puth. was out there. That was the last one. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I think Charlie Puth was there. Was that his name? Charlie Puth. The, yeah. the, and there's a guy in the thing, and he was everybody That's was just fire. waiting for a Peso Pluma. And I, also and, and also it was in Arizona. If he was like yeah. a huge, huge if he was second to yeah. last, I think it's very possible that he's gonna headline Coachella. If he's that it far up on sense. the building. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and 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 honestly, I'm surprised Coachella TikTok. Is crazy. Uh, from, yeah. I'm surprised TikTok even put on a show like that. I, I've never seen them do that. Even well, yeah, like, I think it was new. the first one. Yeah, I think it's new. Yeah, that the shit looked cool, one. man. That shit looked it like looked, really dope. Yeah, it yeah. looked really cool. I sh- oh God, no, you should have been there. Yeah, no, I didn't get invited. It's because I don't do like next the, year, next year, next year. I don't year. do like the. I um, saw your Instagram story. It's, it turned into like blog posts. Can we talk about that? Yeah, I did. I was like, shit. I'm talking my shit. Yeah, talk about it. Um. Yeah, you know, brands be scared to fuck with me. Mm-hmm. That's what, that. Are you waiting on the mother? What? Yeah, they be scared to fuck with me because I'm too ghetto. So they've told you you're too ghetto? Nah, but... You could feel it? Yeah. Sometimes you could feel it, huh? Yeah. People yeah. think you can't feel it. Mm-hmm. Even other influencers that probably have like a squeaky clean image, do you feel that from them like to associate with you or not? Um, Like, shout out like the ones that I'm really dope with. Like, mm. um, Us? Yeah, shout out you guys. <laughs> um, But there's like a lot of influencers where like we could probably never do a skit together because I say bitch and fuck. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, yeah, and like, yeah. but but I feel it. Like, some people have homes to feed and kids, mm-hmm. and if just different audiences. If too. if um if fucking like I know a homie that got like a big ass fucking like like a like a phone um provider. Yeah, a big ass deal, but it was like. Let yeah. me run with my kids in the backyard. And, right, right. Oh, it's right. more than that. My dog. That yeah. yeah, and which which bro like. Get your bag. There's a yeah, get your bag. Get yeah. your bag. Like, but I'm just personally not gonna do that. Yeah. yeah like if you. Well, give, it's not you. Like if yeah. T-Mobile gave me a bag right now, I said we need you to pretend BB on the phone on T-Mobile for the next month. Hit up. I'm arguing with my bitch on the phone for a skit. Yeah. Yeah. I'm throwing my phone. And, I'm throwing my phone across the room and going to go go to T-Mobile store and getting the new one. Yeah. yeah. But like when I did the McDonald's one, it was dope. They kind of let me do my thing. Yeah. Right. And I try not. I didn't curse a lot. Mm-hmm. I try yeah. to like you limit need to it. like tone it down. Yeah, yeah. I limit it, and I think I said like stupid or dumbass, and that was um, okay for that. And it was dope because it was like a franchise, but they still work directly with with McDonald's. Yeah, mm-hmm. and that was dope. Like an agency. And know? it was funny yeah. because we were just with I was, <laughs> I was following with Conquer that I was drunk posting when I was drunk. I posted that when I was drunk, and we and shout out Conquer he has a deal with AT and T, but we're taking a picture of AT and T, and I'm like, Conquer's like fool, you can't do that. <laughs> but obviously they're, they're at a comedy show, so yeah. how like, many times have we told you not to do that, dude? It's just a habit. Well, see, the thing is, it's I just feel like, like, that's just like your post. Every yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But like you have to also think. No, hundred percent. Billboards, yes, magazine, yes. hundred percent, hundred percent. I, the, the thing, I'm like learning as I go for yeah. sure. The thing about like, I feel like what you do know is like you're the same person when the mics turn on and they turn off. So that's and, and not everybody is. Yeah, you know, yeah, a lot of the like squeaky clean influencers. They have their on camera persona, yeah. and then there's somebody completely different Behind. off of it. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And I think why people love you is your authenticity. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. And, so and, like, and shout out people like that because I got anything yeah. else. Because I don't want to diss them either. Because what yeah, I no. do think is that they are like that too. But Duno's authentic self and their authentic self, Duno's just very extreme yes. on the raw. Yeah, but it's like that's who he is. But that's who they are too. Yeah, for sure. You know what for I'm sure. saying? Like they're yeah. just not. They're normal, and Duno's normal is very different. His uh-huh. normal and our normal is different. Yeah, for, for sure. You know? For sure. Yeah. Because even like that I doesn't was... mean he's more real than any of us. Yeah, but no, it's no, just, no, no, no. Yeah, yeah. What's authentic to him is different from yeah, what's authentic sure. to others. And which, which I like, but even like um, Friday, I was work. I went to go do a vlog with with the homies, and it was my first time really like. I've done it before. Work with other YouTubers. Yeah. Sat down with them and done an interview. But I sat down. I, we were doing a vlog for. Shout out my homie Blessed. He's doing like ten days of Blessed, where he's like filming. He's dropping a vlog for oh, ten days sad. straight till Christmas. Mm-hmm. And we did one of them, and it was just like seeing like YouTubers when they come together and really collab. I was like, it's a lot of work. <laughs> like I just, <laughs> and, but, I'm, but I, I just like being with my homies. And shout out everybody that fucks with each other. Yeah. But like on. Thanksgiving and shit like that. I'm doing it with my best friends. I'm not. Yeah, the I'm pro- I probably don't want to like. And yeah. people do that. People want to link with other YouTubers. Oh, yeah, for certain YouTubers. Things. Right. But I, I just personally want to be with my best friends. Yeah, and people yeah. out here sometimes they moved out here so they don't have their like day. Yeah, ones, yeah, like, that's yeah, for sure, ones. for sure. And they can yeah. be going back home for the holidays. But yeah, I, I, I fuck with everybody. Like I work like Concrete's comedy is totally different than my. You know, he's right. a, he's, yeah. he's an older and my boy Jerry Garcia. You're like a sh- like and not, and just I'm putting it in radio terms because yeah. that's how I know it. 
But you think of like a Howard Stern or Charlemagne, like it's the quote unquote shock jock. Yeah. Um, and you have that shock value to you. Yes, it's gonna keep you from a lot of like the squeaky clean stuff. Mm-hmm. However, when it's your shit, like no one can touch it. Yeah. You know? Yeah. And then like your stuff is gonna make you stand out more because there's a lot of squeaky clean stuff. A lot of people are more normal or like kind of to that than what you are. You're extremely raw. And I know you know that. And yeah. like that's just kind of like what life has mm-hmm. has experienced with you and how you are but that's also special because i know that sometimes it can feel frustrating which is what i saw in that post you were a little bit like fuck y'all like Mm -hmm. like, yeah i I definitely be in that fans dissing me or not fans like brands dissing me or other creators dissing me like y'all like i'm just being myself y'all i'm too ghetto or whatever it can get upsetting but i promise you that's just gonna pay off and you know that you know because even like but see that's why whoever does fuck with me like in a setting to where Mm -hmm. like they like kind of let, me, they kinda yeah. let me, like, bro, that's why I have a lot of, like, like little bro, older bro respect for Concrete. Yeah. Right. But whenever I'm in the back, he's just like, fool, you got this. Yeah. Oh, and and okay. I have a video from, like, four years ago where Concrete spoke into, um, I think my homie was recording me in a, in a, in a GoPro. Mm-hmm. And um, and there was somebody else there that was acting bougie. I'll tell you guys. I'm going to say it, but... Um, 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 well, bleep it, bleep it, bleep oh. it. It was... um. Damn. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. He was like, he was like, and, yeah, yeah. and Conky oh. was in the camera, was like, man, shout out my boy Duno. Like, he's going to be next up. Like, we're out here rooting for him. Wow. Yeah. And, to this, and to that's this fine. day, he, he, he shows remembers? that type of love and, like, oh, yeah. respect. So that's why for Conky, I have, like, But what diff- did the other fool do in the back? Or what was he doing? Oh, I think they tried to introduce us, and he kind of just, like, shunned me off. Mm. Like how? Oh, like, just, like, just shunned me off. Como? Like, they were like, hey, this is my boy. And he was like, what's up, bro? And just like. Mm. Uh, but, yeah. yeah. But look, like the thing about you is like you have so far like to still go and like grow and mature. Yeah. Because like if you look back at like Eddie Murphy's first stand up, Mm -hmm. he like literally it's called Raw. And he was saying all types of wild shit. I'm sure a lot of brands back then were like, oh, he's too ghetto. Yeah. He's, a, he's too, too much, crazy, yeah. da, 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 right? Yeah, he's, he's, he's crazy. He was, right, in the 80s. I but, can't wait bro, for the Duno switch up when he's, he's named Dr. Doolittle. Clean. Bro, Dr. Doolittle, Shrek, Donkey. Like, he's gotten so far. Haunted Mansion, like, yeah. he's come so far yeah, yeah, from that person that he was. It's the same person. Yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? But yeah, it's but you don't talk just, the same. No, not at all. So I can't wait till Duno's in that. <laughs> I just go, I go it to takes time. Yeah. Hello, guys. Yeah. Like, <laughs> what's up, <laughs> everybody? Eddie, Eddie was in his 20s. <laughs> like oh, early 20s. Now he's yeah. in his oh, 60s. Oh, is crazy. Yeah, oh, you know yeah. <laughs> yeah so, I, so I think that's up. Even like I met, um, there's a really dope comedian. He's been killing it for you. I've been watching, but I finally met him. Um, Alfred Robles. Okay. Bro, he's he opened for Fluffy a lot. He's like, mm. oh. he's the one with the sombrero. I don't know. You guys probably seen him on TikTok. Uh, but he's fucking heavy. He's younger hilarious. or older? He's older. Okay, I don't know. It's really rare seeing somebody yeah. my age. Yeah. They like true. look at me like. Yeah. And I'm like, I look that fucking old. I gotta just. I'm back at the gym now, too. Let's go. But I was like, damn, that fool were looking at me like I was fucking dirty. I was like, that's kind of a little disrespectful. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Like, do you, do you get that fight. a lot, though? Like, you look a lot older. Well, because these was in, in the green rooms, even like I learned this while we were at the, the comedy stars with George Perez and Concrete and everybody. They're talking about kids and. And oh, wives gotcha. and, and homes people. and everybody's getting and I'm like, yeah, 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 who you, you with? <laughs> and then I was like, I was like, I want boys. <laughs> and the homie Matt looks on there like, damn, little ass kids. <laughs> and then and, and, and somebody's like, he's 23 too, fool. <laughs> and then they just start like, oh, you fucking, you yeah, fuck could be your dad. And <laughs> I would imagine those green rooms are fucking hilarious. <laughs> like, <laughs> if if stop like, everybody hey, bro, shooting back at each other. Yeah, if you're, hey, if you're back there, it's like a, you better get ready to get a cracking with session. the wrong sessions. Yeah. <laughs> or or, or for you'll come off stage and they'll be like, oh, you did good, bro. They'll be like, he wasn't even watching, fool. They're like brutally honest with everybody. Right. It's, it's crazy as fuck. That's tough. It's mm-hmm. kind of like, it's kind of like corridos in the food in the green room. Everybody's just singing and playing guitar. That's the what I feel time. like it's like, yeah. Yeah. But it's a vibe. Yeah. That's What's our green room situation gonna look like at the live show? It's so fucking dope. It's big as fuck. Who's so gonna be in there? It, I don't know. Is it one room for all of us? No, there's no, like no. There's a few rooms. There's a whole oh, floor. But that room is a fucking whole floor huge. of just rooms. There's yeah. there's vanity mirrors. There's showers. Yeah. Like, but like I'm telling you, it's player. There's like a huge yep. couch. Like Angie has created her Angie's creations. It's because now I'm Team Crocs. Hey, so we officially have a brown bag gibbet. 
We've Woo-hoo! talked about it before, Should but that. we've Somebody never done it. No, 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 the bag. Angie oh. made a brown bag gibbet. This is my favorite oh, one right here. Oh, that's so tight. And it's adjustable, it's you guys. brown bag all what? over. Yeah. And it yeah. says. Straps are adjustable. It says brown bag pot. I fucking love it. So fucking sick. We've had bolsitas before. This yeah. is like incredible. I was, yeah. telling Angie, I was telling Angie that this yeah. this is like a full on purse. Like my yeah. mom used my mom mm-hmm. uses the other one from for market because we're in the new age where they charge yeah. you for <laughs> ten, <laughs> cents, yeah. ten cents a bag. Well, and just they, in California, yeah. This is super lit. tight. You can only get that at the live show. Yes, and and if you bought a meet and greet, this one's for you. And if, yeah. yeah, and if you didn't, it's not then, too late. And you have to there's flags. Two more days. Which there's flags? Like, mm-hmm. Card flags. It's underneath. Oh, oh my God. Wow. First time. I'm like, we have to. Yeah, you can open this it. I'm going to so rock fire. those it's flags like, like a fucking Laker flag flags? and it's yeah. championship. It's oh, it's flags. flags. Yeah, Bandera. card flags. Yeah. I thought it was like the one of Letty. I, I have that one in my other card. <laughs> well. Yeah, oh. the, smelly thing, the smell <laughs> sense one. Oh, the air freshener. The air freshener. Oh. <laughs> I know people thought I was weird for having what? your, your air fresheners in my car. Flag. I, know, I know, I know. I corrected myself. They're I said the air freshener okay. ones. If I give them to all my homies. Oh, so let these right <laughs> I don't know what happened after all that. Your homies? Like, oh, that's perfect. So oh, <laughs> that's so tight. That makes me so much more excited for the live show. That's yeah. hilarious. Dude, rocking a brown bag flag, like fucking it's finals time. Yes. Yes. Magic, yeah. Like it's 2002? Down the freeway. Oh, my God. When the Lakers are going to we see them? <laughs> Should I have a brown bag flag on my own car? Yes. Or would that cost too much Duh. attention? Should Duh. you what? Vic, you think, like, shut up. You, lo- you love it. Vic right there. You- Damn the flag's sick. Oh, that's it's fucking so dope. Fucking wave it, Duna. Wave it, wave it, wave it. Wave it. That shit That'll is be so all your car. fucking tight. If I didn't have the reindeer ears on my car, after, I would after, have that. After, yeah. After. after fucking, after Christmas. That's yeah. dope. Yes, fun. this is fire. I'm going to give one to all my hosts. We, 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 for we gotta make ourselves your little face. Kidding, just kidding, just kidding. Here, you're, this your flag? Yes. We're not gonna have like enough. Man big. on the moon. Yeah. We're not gonna have enough. Yeah. I was here. Yeah. I was here. And you pull up to your girl and she oh. has a flag and they gave it. If her. your girl got a brown bag flag, she was just getting, know. She's she's getting fucked in the ass. I don't know. Oh shit. Was, what? That was too much. Yeah. <laughs> that <was> too much. <laughs> we two one and we're back. Yeah. And we're back, and Duno says he has the more most ultimate. He's trying, he's trying to compete. Hold on. It's, my ears. You, you know what? It's okay. Not... Question: Ears on or off? When I have my ears on, I feel like you know in Super Mario yeah. where uh, they oh, turn yeah, into yeah, the when you, fuck when you get a star, the raccoon, yeah, the, yeah, the yeah, raccoon yes. one. Yes. yes, great. That's a fucking. Oh, but I'm Luigi. On, okay, on. Luigi vibes. Well, Lu- well, Luigi doesn't get that. They like, both do. Does Luigi get the raccoon? Luigi vibes? can get the raccoon. Let me look. I think it's when they hit the thing and it comes out, right? They hit the little the little question box. It has the feather. Yeah, yeah the feather. No, the feathers when they become where they could jump higher and do like more. Damn, Mario's a good game. Yeah. It was a great movie Luigi, too. Raccoon. Yes. Luigi great movie. So they 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 haven't missed. Yeah, Luigi can do it too. Look. Yeah. Ah. So for like me. Nah. So what is the ultimate achievement? Yes. Okay. So I can't say all details because I already got him oh, in trouble. Oh, my God. But I'm going to just tell you guys the cheese map. Say after. the details and then we'll block it off. Okay. <laughs> so yesterday I bring up the cheese man in the car. It's just me pulling his girl. Oh. And you can't. He wasn't keep supposed all of to. That. I, I just have to. I have to. It's uh, sorry, you guys. I love you guys to death. I just so can't. The, okay. So I, keep in mind, I say the cheese man, and the car. The car ride is cool. We're like talking, like we're like laughing, and then um, I get off the car like nothing, and poet girls, girls, poet girl goes like, good night, but like I've never heard her say good night to me like that, mm-hmm. and then I get off the whip. And then, like, I'm in the shower, like, I'm vibing out, I'm bumping music, and I'm switching the song, you know? And then Poet calls me, and he's like, fool, why the fuck did you say that? And I was like, what did I say? And then he t- and then he was like, she fucking told me not to tell you because you was fucking play too much. Oh, so he she found out that he told you he because told me you cheese mentioned man. it. Yeah. And so I she's feel, mad and at him for telling you the cheese man that she said, don't tell this fool. Yes, and I feel terrible because... Usually she takes the jokes and rolls with the punches, and um, she was already a little upset at me because I oh. brought up the fact that she always wants to come to the yeah, events. like last podcast. Now, okay, yeah. so she said that somebody told there's always her somebody sister, watching that her sister told her like, hey, they're talking about you on Duno's podcast, 
I like how they never directly just say, I listen to the yes, podcast. Yes, it's always yeah, yeah. that. Somebody told he me. He tells me, like, the girls are like, oh, yeah, I was just my in my cousin, car and they turned yeah, on. Right. Okay. My they, cousin yeah, was I, listening. Yeah, and the they fucking bitches think they got Bumblebee specific. off. <laughs> Bitch, stop. This ain't no fucking Transformers. Bitch. So I'm like, I, and, and, but I, I tell my friends, like, fool, I'm going to talk about it on the pod. This is like my, this is my therapy. It I come in venting. here. And yeah. I'm like, hey, dog, like, and, and, and yesterday I was getting mad because I feel like everybody, and I was like, hey, if, if you fool the one, don't kick it with me then. Oh. And I was tripping, like, you fool the one, all these little, little crying bullshit in. Ain't nobody die or nothing, fool. Like, I'm going to sit here and come, fool, like I can call on my mom, my dad, all that, fool. I don't give a fuck about your little relationship, who's mad at who. Suck a dick, fool. Don't talk about it then. I'm, I'm tripping, fool. Like, I'm going to tell your cheese up your dick. Like, yeah. it's funny, fool. If, as long as I'm not saying your girl got HIV or you, the Wait, homie. What? <laughs> <laughs> That's a very extreme example. <laughs> but nobody got Wait, HIV. Who's girl has HIV? I know. That example. Fix. <laughs> Whoa. You I don't have a girl. I don't have a girl. Your cousin I don't have has a girl. HIV? I don't have a girl. It's okay. You have a cousin. Oh, a yeah. I lost <laughs> you. You guys, you guys follow the last part. I lost all my no, girls. No, he has a new one. Don't lost, fucking say lost that. lost all my girls. Okay, okay, okay. So chip out. So chip out. You're going to so, get in trouble for so, saying so, that. So, so, I'm, so I'm like, I'm like, hey, dog, like all these little crying bullshit, like, like unless it's really serious or like, and I'm not going to say it. You know what I'm saying? Like, fool, I told you guys that. You're going to have instrumental playing like she just did. See? Be serious, see? Yeah, like, he so knows. I'm like, so I'm like, all right, fool, it's, it's never, but I'm guessing she got mad and got out the whip and all this shit, right? So oh. then. I like how she was like, good night, yeah. you motherfucker. <laughs> That's what I'm oh. Okay, so the homie DJ. Why the fuck does he know? Why the fuck does he know? Yes, I told I'm... you not to fucking tell him. And here you go fucking telling him. And he's making his own fucking jokes. He has a million next... fucking followers. Yeah. He's going to tell the whole yeah. world. And next fucking podcast, <laughs> they're going to know. <laughs> and that's all I was like, hey, my bad, dang. I'm like, I feel, I really feel bad yeah, for yeah. you. Because. Say sorry to the Oaxacan community. Oaxacan community? <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. You have to eat a cricket now. The champ does what the fuck he wants. <laughs> yeah. yeah. What is that? The champ does what the fuck oh he wants. Oh, my God. But, but look, I genuinely feel bad. So I, point, I was like, hey, fool, I'm sorry. And I was thinking about, like, I, I don't follow her on IG, but I know he did. I was going to look for him and be like, hey, fool, like, just know, like, I wasn't even, like, saying it like that. You know, I was literally and just. And now you're going to get him more in trouble <laughs> for telling you, for him telling you that she told him not to tell you and then that. She got in trouble for telling you. Uh, I never thought about that. Yeah, but don't like, hear her up at all. Because okay, now you're just yeah. telling her again that he told you again. Yeah. Well, she probably told him not to tell you. But, but, I, feel look, like, look. but I feel like it's a great argument. Like, he told, I told her for like, today I called him. And I was like, hey, my bad. But he was like, fool, I told you you're my best friend. And then me, he's serious. And I'm like, oh, besties. And he's like, fool, he don't fucking take anything serious. He just clicked on me. <laughs> no, but my but you were happy because but you this, missed your friend Poet. Are you sabotaging their relationship? I'm I'm I, I'm not sabotaging it because I've done the, okay. So there's like this thing to where like I feel like everybody should understand my sense of humor. I'm guessing not yeah, everybody you does. Yeah, do, you feel that. <laughs> so yeah. before the homie DJ was with his new girl, he had an ex girlfriend. Who's that? I've the never homie heard DJ. Of you know the homie DJ. Yeah, yeah. 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 Skinny, skinny, skinny dude. Skinny dude. You gotta see him. Yeah. The homie Devin. His name's Devin. Oh. Maybe, yeah, yeah. I'll show you. So one time we were at the homegirl's party and I was like, Yeah, DJ, remember that one girl? But I'm joking. I don't even. This was like before DJ got really close with the group. So I'm I'm finished, making up this girl. I finished all my water, you guys. Uh, I'm yeah, here. I'm trying to. I'm, I'm almost done. So I'm so I'm making up this girl. They leave. DJ calls me screaming. I told you guys a story. And the girl got off on the freeway. Essentially, that's what happened with Port. So I'm 2-0. <laughs> Wait, are you 2-0 or 0-2? I'm 2-0. So two. 2 is a win. I'm 2-0 making girls get off the freeway. I'm, you know what? I'm striving to be the best at it. What do you mean get off the freeway? So the homies, girls have a thing about when they're mad, when I when I start a fight between them and they leave, they get off on the freeway. <laughs> and I, remind oh, you to, they get out of the car? So and wild, like, oh, fuck yeah. So wild stat. <laughs> what that Yo. bitch? So crazy. Oh my That's God. crazy stat. Hey, Two take, and O and making girls that aren't his yeah. get off the freeway. You want to add the girls that are were yours that got off the freeway? Nah, I just child lock my bitches. Oh, ch- the homies gotta learn how to child lock. I, child lock you acting childish, you gonna get a child lock. Yeah, exactly. See, I'm a bit. <laughs> <laughs> but I generally feel terrible because the homie Paul is girl, and, and I'm gonna say your name. I'm, oh I'm, I'm, I'm doing public apology. I, so, uh, uh, so you're saying Paul is girl jumped out of the freeway? You might make it worse. This okay. is gonna make it worse. Why? Because you, he, you I'm apologizing. No. 
She prayed to a point not to tell you again about her telling him why the fuck he told you about the first shit. Hey, why did she jump that on the freeway? Hey, I don't think she needs to understand this. What if she jumped no, off again? I'm three and oh. <laughs> but look, okay, okay. Right, yeah, but, but, hold on. Okay, okay, let's look, be honest. Okay, okay. Wait, 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 before you apologize. It's not a fucking Fast and the Furious movie, fool. She didn't jump off and fucking rolled around and is alive. Because, by the way, you guys, don't, don't fucking do that, couples. It's a, but I'm going to just take whatever comes. I'm rolling with the punches. Like, for example, if if we argue in the house, I know you're going to walk out. You're yes. going to want space. You're going to be away from me. The perfect time to at least have a conversation. Because for us, it's conversations. For yes. you guys, it's an argument. Yeah. For us, it's like but, getting... But, but I'm just, for, for us, us it's, it's communicating. Just, it's just, I just want to know yeah. how come. <laughs> I think it's so funny. <laughs> uh, okay. But we choose the car rides because we know we're going to go somewhere. And we're, I hear, I'm got, I got you. You're driving. You're not you can't like, escape. yeah, we need to have this combo now. At the house, you're going to walk out. Hey. On text, you're going to stop texting. On a call, you're going to hang up. In the car, though? And this is why Tyrese had ejecto cito <laughs> 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 no, no, you guys, I genuinely, no, 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 I swear to God. <laughs> look, 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 yes, we were, hey, you guys, yeah. like, we were having a great night. We're at bowling for the Humby Matt's birthday. We're bowling. We're doing it up. We're having a great time. We're, having, we're competing team of five of five. You know what I'm saying? And it was just one of those things to where I thought the night was perfect. And I just brought it up as conversation. I'm just a conversationalist. I don't know if that's a word. <laughs> it's not a word. Yeah, no, you, it is, but you just... I yeah, said it wrong? No, you just said it a little bit wrong. Okay, how do you it's say it? It's a little it? chunty. No, you just put it like a conversationalist. There yeah. Conversationalist. There you go. Yeah. There you go. Okay, so I'm one of those fools. And... <laughs> I was generally just starting a conversation. I thought it was like, it's a dope thing. It's a super small world. I didn't mean no harm. Yeah. And I generally like... It is a super to, small world. How do yeah, they... And, to be um, Duno's the and like his, his defense attorney real I'm, quick. I'm generally just... I don't think it's, anything's ever that serious. But I'm guessing uh, it was. And I generally feel bad because I didn't mean no harm. Like, bro, like I'm like pretty much respectful. And I'm like, I'll talk shit, but like in my head, maybe on skit. Never say no names. Never do... So like... I didn't, but I, I generally feel bad and he, he was Don't like, you mean incredible harm? I don't know if this is a setup question. Man, I'm hungry. <laughs> Man, I'm hungry. Don't you mean incredible harm? Oh. Oh, that was good. That's a bar. <laughs> that was good. That was really good. I'll put that in the group chat right now. That's a bar. <laughs> but you know, no, but I generally was like, oh, they got to. And it's funny because I got like head and shoulders in my eye. And I'm like, hey, fool, my bad way. And he's like, fuck, fool, you're stupid, fool. And Poe is like little bro, so he's usually like kind of on my side. Yeah. And 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 hey, call him and apologize. He's mad because like his. I should call him and apologize. His girl probably hasn't talked to him in a couple of days, type, like or like she's probably been cold to him, type shit, you know. But yeah, I, I generally feel bad um, to Poe and his Oaxacan um, princess queen. Queen. Um, I I definitely apologize for. Um, and I hope you know that if you're mad at him, please don't be mad at us. Specifically, don't be mad at me. Yeah, me neither. Because I appreciate you. I met you at the at the garage. Yeah. You're really nice. Yeah, exactly. Yeah, she's a great girl. Great girl. Yeah. I, I, well, I don't know. You're trying to fuck it up for her. She's growing on me. And, and I think she's amazing. She um she matches the homie's energy. She started to dress really nice. Started to dress really nice? You know, she was a little chundy at first. Mm. But you know, the homie's swaggy, so you know, yep. he's putting it on game. She's hip now. She's taking jokes, she's throwing little shots back. And I'm like, this is what I wanted in the first place. I just, you know, as a, as, as a development coach for this family yeah. and this group, I, I need you to understand that this is my house. Yeah. And when you're in my house, you're going to follow our rules in this household. And if not, don't come around, don't hang out. And this goes for everybody and anybody that decides to join this family. And if you're not okay with that, well, then choose another one. Another family? But you're not going to get loyalty, love, friendship, free bottles at the club with the other family. With you're this bad. one, you're going to do it up. Live shows. Mm-hmm. Y'all love being at the live shows, but you right. can't get that in other love families. Being at the live yeah. shows, but you hate the drama that comes with it. <laughs> love, Pick one. Hey, sometimes yeah. you're the main. This character. is what comes with VIP access, motherfuckers. Yeah. Everybody, hey, everybody loves the live show. Yeah, but when it comes, motherfucker, if I don't do this, then we don't have no live show. Yeah. yeah. So remember when you weren't content? Yeah. Exactly. So the yeah. Fuck? you gotta put together. all your business the out there, yeah. so yeah. everybody knows. And know the only people talking about you is your tias. The fuck? Exactly. Yeah. Vic, yeah. Fucking Vic. Put your whole life on this. Fucking Vic is fucking <laughs> depressed and lonely at the age of thirty-one. You know why? Vic, For content. <laughs> For content, because I love yeah. my people. Exactly. Not yeah. these hoes. Yeah. You love these hoes. I do. I do. I do. I do too. <laughs> and, and they're not hoes. And they're not hoes. And they're not hoes. And you guys are nice ladies. They're very beautiful to me. All it of just them. sounds good saying it. <laughs> hey, 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 are you going to be cuffed starting the year? 
Yes. No. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You have a new yes. boo? Yes. No. Yes. 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 Don't lie. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I just His wanted. cousin. <laughs> no, I His just cousin, trolled everybody. Cousin. Stop saying he's a cousin fucker. No, no I'm not a cousin is. fucker. No, I'm not. No, I trolled everybody. Because we went to Greg's and, yeah. I, and I brought somebody. And I told Maximo, I was like, hey, I'm going to mess with everybody. In the I'm chat, a- he put, I'm bringing my cousin. So and, he brings, and you were macking and we're at the party? He brings a girl and they're macking. <laughs> <laughs> so everybody's looking at me weird and didn't want to sit next to me. And I was the like, The same why? dude that had the story of cousins kissing in the jumper totally, when they were little. I totally, for, that's why I did it. But I totally forgot that I mentioned that in the group chat. So then, so I didn't like clean it up and be like, "Hey guys, I'm just kidding. She's not my cousin." Mm. So everybody's just looking at me weird. She had to, like Vic a little bit. A little yeah. bit. No, her yeah, last she, name was Leo. She had his mustache. <laughs> That's not true. <laughs> <laughs> These are all false allegations. She had. She's like his she, eyebrows without him clearing up the unibrow. She looks nothing like me. Mm-hmm. Let's can I see. see her? Can I see her? She look good. You already met her before. Oh. Where? Let me see her. So it's not a new one because it's one you, you brought back. Bro. Yeah. I met her where at your family party? No. Is oh. she is she in a, is she in Agua Fresca? No. No. no, no. Three P? She was nice. Woohoo. Three finger combo? Oh my gosh, not three finger combo. I have still to meet her. <laughs> I know. <laughs> she comes to life. How did she come back? I don't know. It was just a misunderstanding. No, you, no it wasn't. <laughs> it was just a misunderstanding. No, it wasn't. Three finger combo, then London. No, that's the same person. Yeah, I know. Oh, okay, yeah, yeah. Then Vegas. Greg's backyard. It was just no, a Greg. misunderstanding. Yeah. 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 Okay. We cleared it all up. Do you oh, like her? Oh, I'll you talk to she's cool. Yeah. That was talk to the manager. Do you like games. her? Do you know? Oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> she's she, been back around. I met her and she was like, give her a compo and I just fucking. Oh, yeah. I was, yeah, like, yeah. I was like, a good sport. <laughs> yeah. She's, yeah. she's yeah. come back yeah. around, so that shows me. Did you meet her? No, I haven't met her. That okay. shows me she's durable. Yeah. <laughs> okay, what does that word mean? You know, I'm a little Durable slow. means reliant. Like, oh, okay. Yeah. Like but you know what I, li- I like most is that like, she blocked me. Like, she ain't afraid to block me. I was like, yeah, yeah that was gangster. Wait, wait. Yeah. Okay. Oh, like she's the one that shit. She did block I like you. Like shit. <laughs> <laughs> That's bad. Uh. I'm like, damn, you had the balls to block me? That's crazy. I like it. Marry me. Yeah, see? <laughs> um, Jesus. Wow. Did she, did, did she watch your... Your two other ones go down the drain and she no. felt like it was her time to come back? No, she has no idea. Yeah. <laughs> Please don't watch these episodes anymore. <laughs> I know. You should you should have that in contract. If yeah. you're dating me, you can't watch Brown Back. I know, but you know. Or the family. That's what I hope for. I feel like it's like unset, like, because you don't want to say, like don't watch this episode. Because our main goal is then to get viewers, it. but then it's like. <laughs> <laughs> I hope just certain people don't watch. Well, I link, yeah, see, like I linked with somebody I like had a thing with like in the seventh grade. Oh, you guys are, are spinning the block. Yeah, okay. I spin the block, but, but, but I wasn't making any color my cousin. Yeah. I, we, we just like kicked it, ate some food, went to Truly LA and Little Tokyo and just about okay. that, talked about All life. Right. But she was, it was like the homegirl shit. But talked I, about but, 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 out, talked about life. You guys fucked in the car. We did it. We did it. We did it. I dropped her off on promise. Juro a Dios. But by the time this pod drops, you would have smashed. No, no, no. Because <laughs> tell I'm, me about the thing. <laughs> <laughs> tell me about the story you wanted me to see. <laughs> okay, before I get to that, um, I recently linked up with somebody that I had a thing with like uh, two years ago. She's doing amazing. And, you know, I told her, like, I'm, I want to be a changed man in 2024. Two years ago. I knew you two years ago. And, the and teacher? No. The nurse? No. I tried to spin that block. The road was shut down. <laughs> <laughs> they were doing construction. Him. Um, no entry. Only permits. <laughs> exactly. Literally. Um, but now she's like a full-time nurse. Mm. So there's no time for me. She's my favorite. She could dance. Yeah, she can. Um, yeah, no, I, it, it, it's, it's somebody I used to talk to for a long time. Kind of broke her heart, like, really bad before. Mm. But now I'm like, I'm a changed man. You want to come to the live show? <laughs> if he does a piece of shit thing, and if or if you do, if he does a piece of shit thing, are you still on his side? In what sense? Like, if he does something very piece of shitty. To three-finger combo? To a girl. Okay, just in general. Are you on his side or are you on the girl's side? Um, yes. Can you me. give me an example of, like, piece of shit? Like, mm. big, I mean, what I just did? Yeah, literally. Oh, with the two? Yeah. That's light work. <laughs> but you're on his <laughs> side. You're not on the girl's side. Yeah, because, like, one, like, why are you replying to Like, strangers? if he's a piece of shit to a girl, does that affect your guy's friendship? No. He didn't break my heart. But like, but like, you see how he is. But yeah, I don't. I'm, I'm, I'm rooting for him. You know, hopefully he gets out of these trenches. 
Yeah. 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 Like, like, I feel like Jesus Christ and what was the name for the other one? Judas, the bad guy? No, no. no. Moses? No, no, no. <laughs> Who's the one Ooh, that called God? Jesus Christ? Peter? Oh, if Jesus, if Hello Kitty... One, like, oh. as somebody that follows God. What? No, wait, hold no, no, on. I get what Jesus you're saying. Jesus and Hello Kitty, I'm not understanding. No, he's Jesus, saying the, uh, the girls. The Jesus' girls, daughters. The girls. The girls. Oh, the girls. Yeah, I'm yeah. literally thinking of Jesus yeah, Christ. Yeah, me too, me too. Yeah, now I get it. I get no, it. that food didn't do nothing either. <laughs> what? But if 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 Jesus Christ's if daughter. Jesus' daughter and Hello Kitty. Yeah, okay, this is my thing. Like, why the fuck are you replying to strangers for, mm-hmm. Dick? Like, yeah. And then the other one is like. Why are you dating strangers? Don't you, don't you know how people get kidnapped? Like, don't fucking do so that. So like, you'll find a way of how it's their fault. That it's, he... It's definitely their fault. One, <sighs> one, like, learn how to be a player. Like, no. Like, like, no, 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 no. Because see, what's going to happen... I'm still going to ride for Vic. Vic is still my friend. I don't look at Vic different. I understand yeah. that he does shitty things yeah. to girls, but he's still a good guy. And yes. I Great actually guy, like Vic's mentality on things. He's very... I've told you already, Vic. Like, yeah. he's very positive. He always finds a silver lining in things, yeah. even when shit goes wrong. Yeah. Like, he understands shit like that. But he still did a piece of shit thing. It's not their fault. Yes. Oh, um, you're being a weenie right now. No, Honestly, no, no. Like, no, my thing. No, no, no. My thing is, my thing is, this is my thing, right? I if, did the if, wrong if, thing. If, if the homie you didn't did fuck up, like, yes. like, and I like you more for saying you fucked up. I did. Yeah, I remember the last up. last part. But my my thing is that like, hold on, Devil's Advocate wants to talk. Okay, like, okay, go ahead. First of all, and this is just this is just how I talk. Yeah. I'll take nothing offensive. But bitches gotta learn how to mind their own business. Okay, all right. <laughs> I was gonna right. say that in different words. Right. <laughs> Why would you fucking DM her, dick? That's fucking weird. I, my thing is like, if something like, for like a busca encuentra, for like, she would have been backstage, would have met little Rob, all these special guests we're having. You would have had a great time. You would have seen a man that could potentially be your baby father, your husband, the future of your life. Somebody that's doing number one in radio, and you wanna fuck it up because you wanna call somebody and confirm something? Yeah, what's wrong with them? Yeah. What the fuck is wrong with her, dick? Yeah, honestly. And then the other one wants to be, I don't know. But like, I feel it like, like she's over there talking to the priest, like in the convention room. Like, you didn't learn. You have to fucking, but, but you have to confirm your sin before you do that. <laughs> you knew you was a side. You, you're the problem. <laughs> so much about all this God shit, all this fucking God shit, but you want over there to be the side. <laughs> you read the Bible, right? You can't be in feeling that motherfucker. <laughs> so if you advocate that shit, you want to do some devil? That's a, that's what devil's work. Is it not? Is it not? Hey, is it, oh my god! Is it you, not the devil's you work? You made so much sense right now. Who's been married before here? <laughs> not you, not neither. Letty, Letty's about to Letty. fucking burst through that door real fast. <laughs> Fool. There's, that is the devil's work. That is the devil's work. <laughs> the Letty. devil's work. Context no, clues. No, she didn't know she was the side until after. They, it was found out there was a main. I don't know, but that's the devil's no, no, no. work. No, he made it seem like they were getting like a like like mm, rehashing shit. Not really. You didn't tell her you were talking to someone. No, I didn't. But I didn't. So I didn't have to. He doesn't have to. But no, he doesn't have to. How would she know she was the side of otherwise? Because I order wouldn't to reply know you're to her. The side, no, for you're days so at a time. Stupid. In order to know you're the side, <laughs> devil's work, You bro. know that he has a girl. That's how you know you're the side. To her, he devil's didn't work, have a girl. Bro. Yeah. Be yeah. careful. No, I get what you're saying. I feel that, but like, is there something in the Bible that says she found out she was the side? Okay, let you've been married the before. The other girl, I'm married. I know, I know. <laughs> you have one. I mean, it's like you're married. You've you've gotten you've done the marriage shit before. Currently, yes, yeah, so currently. Don't okay. be fucking wishing before is on me. I was trying to put in the air. <laughs> <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Wait, but wait, wait, my wait. thing is, is there not? Hey, Jorge will run the six miles over here. It'll fuck you hey, up. Yeah, will run six miles. Yes. Man, that's crazy. Yeah, that's crazy. Hey, that was crazy. Yeah, shit, Jorge. Okay. Ready for my eyes? That was funny. My, no, it wasn't. And fuck I think you. It was like, fuck you, fool. Yeah. Hey, but look, this is my thing. I've been to a wedding recently, and I think it said something like, if you're the side piece. No, it didn't. It didn't say that in a wedding. You're part of the devil's work. And I they feel, say that. It might be in different words. Like, if you're the sword <laughs> that breaks the cloud and... <laughs> oh, my God. Yeah. I'm just saying, if Vic, you, like, yeah. Vic was, in was the happy. eyes of God, he was, he he was, was tempted. Yes, he was tempted. That's, I was, what, that's I was. what the devil was going to do. I was. That was Eve. Yeah. She made you bite the apple. That's yeah, what I'm saying. Wait. Why'd you bite the apple? And the apple I didn't mean to. Be, uh, I didn't mean to. Brent Fires or whatever the fuck it was. What was the apple? Yeah. Yeah, it was that. Brent Fires. But like, yeah, my, my thing was like, when, when the situation Jeez. is like settled and stuff, like, I mean, I haven't spoken to any of them. You're drinking alcohol, like, I'm drinking water. Salute, salute, salute. 
Um, <laughs> pussy, you're a pussy. When, when things kind of settled and like I had more time to think about it, again, I did completely wrong. I'm going to keep standing by that. But uh, for them, like just the more I think about it, like for them to hop on the phone was like wild to me. That part was like on both their ends. Like I get it. <laughs> But at the same time, like, no, no, Stand like, business, we're adults. We're yeah. adults, right? I don't have, do I have kids with either one of them? Yeah. No. You, have we been in a long-term relationship? Okay. No. Did I know them before 2022? No. no. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm just thinking, wait, wait, like. Wait, she, she the, gave them AirPods? Amazing the more, Did one of them buy me AirPods? Yes. But, like, the more I was thinking about it, I'm just like, it's not that serious. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like to you. They had both <laughs> cared about you. Did they? Yes, the common denominator is you. Both of them. They're thought, using you, brother. If they no, both, both care, then why not thought, be with him while his hardest times? It's just like that's a little he betrayed soon. Both of them. That's a little soon. You know what I'm saying? Because I totally get. I'm in a four year relationship, and you yeah. know, then you know that that girl's like, oh, you know what? I think this guy's cheating on me. I get it. We're in a long time. Maybe we live together. Maybe we we have kids together. Like all this shit. I'm like. I just barely met both of y'all. Like, what are we doing? Right, like, which one of them is bringing the glue to put your heart back together? Not, none of them. Yeah, which one's going to be the heart surgeon? You guys get what I'm saying? I, I, get, I get what Letty said. I, I, mean, I understand that part. More, me more so, I was just like, that was wild. Something yeah, I wouldn't do personally. For them to do. My thing In my is opinion. Like, my thing is like, if there's such a great, beautiful, young, great father... You, you guys are number one on, the, on LA. Ali's right? watching this like... You guys are number no, one. I, no, honestly, the pod is doing amazing. We're going to London. You London, might be fucking bro. somebody else in London, but that don't matter because we're in a different country. Let's just move on from that situation right there, right? <laughs> he's amazing. He, he. Oh no, I agree. He's doing no, no. I'm just you pointing guys, it because I'm That's why I told you he can be a fuck asshole, stupid cabron fuck to the a great girls. Word. I'm sorry, that that's one. a good one. But fuck to asshole. me. Like I like he's a stand up person. Like I like his personality. I like like his mindset on things. I was talking to him like, how do you always see the positive in everything? Because yes. it's hard sometimes. I am like a negative thinker. When something bad goes wrong, I think of the, like they call it catastrophic thinking. Like mm -hmm. think of the ultimate worst. It goes all the way bad. And Vic is very good at like you know well like I could see where this works out this way. Like he'll always find like what makes it positive. And it's something I've noticed about him just throughout everything. Yeah. And so I was asking him and he's like, you know what? When bad shit happens, and I think I wish more people had this mentality of when bad shit happens, that just is, hey, the bad shit ha is getting out the way for the good shit to happen. And it's like, that shit is a dope way to think. Yeah. But when he's the actual bad shit happening. <laughs> That's why I'm good luck Chuck. So I need to happen yeah. to you before you find your So they're true both going to get married. You're the test. You're the final boss. Yeah. My thing is, my thing is, I, like, I wish them the best. Honestly, my all, thing all is, jokes aside, I wish them the best. My thing is, if they wanted to, they would. I hope they don't run into anybody else. You like wish me. them the best, but they left the. They best. left the best, so now they got they're okay. left with the rest. You know we gotta do but this. Like, we gotta do this. You gotta invite them to the show. Yeah, they're not going, bro. Why not? Yeah, I you feel like, like I have like, a strong feeling. They would feeling not go. That okay, at okay. least God's daughter will go. I'm gonna do it. No, bro. Look, look, look. I'll invite my exes right now if you invite yours. Just invite your exes because you want to, you no, little fuck No, fuck that, bitch. We're going to talk about it. First of all. <laughs> first this of all, whole pod, and this is our Christmas party, guys. Our, we need to get it together. We need to do some fucking segments. Guys. You know okay, what, we'll you know what it is, Tali? <laughs> There's dick and other bitches lately. That's Let's such a lie. That. That's such a lie. <laughs> I've been at the house, low-key. Yes, yeah. It's been, been handy there. many over there. I've been. <laughs> I'm, I'm fucking chilling with Manuela lately. Yeah. Okay, <laughs> what happened with your girl? Okay, is he going to invite him? Yeah. I'm not inviting anybody. No, you know what? This we, live show, I'm mean, inviting no girls that I have ever slept with. How about that? Well, <laughs> too bad for you because we know them. Three finger combo's not going to come? I just think it's best to just separate church and state. You know what I'm saying? Like, <laughs> <laughs> The three finger combo's not church. That didn't work no, last time. Or state. But like, you know what I'm saying? Like, I just, I don't want any, I don't want to worry about that. I don't okay. want to worry about that. I just want to have a good live performance. You know what uh -huh. I'm saying? With my people that I love so much. Shout yeah. out the crew. Shout out everybody. <laughs> and little Rob. Yeah. 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 Vic is going to have live show bay after no, that. No, I'm not looking for nothing either. Like, that'll just complicate my life even further. So we're inviting him? No, I don't oh. want nobody there. Okay, okay, okay. What if we sit him on top because all the bottom is sold out? What if we sit him on top? They could be with my friend group and if one of them says some wild shit, my sister's bomb on them. 
No. <laughs> no, okay. That's not I don't good. want. I don't want <laughs> any. Of, ideas. I don't, I don't want any of my exes there. I'm gonna text just... dumbass right now and ask her if she's gonna come to the live show. Yeah, tell her not to bring a new man. Oh. You guys, I follow her being petty. Oh. You followed her? And then she, I, just me being a dick. You know, I'm, 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 I'm happy for her. You know, maybe I didn't. I'm like Vic. I want to take accountability. Maybe I didn't take her. Um. Um. I took oh, her for granted. She's so sweet. This is why I don't believe Duno that she's an asshole. Happy birthday, beautiful. May God continue to bless you and open many more doors into your life. Wishing you more years and happiness into your life. That's what's the last DM she She'd be has. fake reading the Bible. No. That's how I know you're the asshole. <laughs> Hold on, wait. She'd be posting John 19, 19. Like, you didn't read that shit. <laughs> so, wait. Are you happy? Like, you're actually happy for her? I don't believe you are. I'm happy for her. Okay, you I are? just text her. Let's, let's, yeah, let's talk about it because I, I, follow, her, I follow her being petty. Okay. And then that same night... She posted. She posted. She posted a guy. Wow. Yeah. And I was like, I'm happy for you. Maybe he... that means she just cares about you. No, no. Yeah, yeah. She's man. trying to or... get under your skin. That's she all. posted a guy, but he was like, he he looked player. He had like a ring on the chain. I was like, yeah. Cause that's that what was I'm... still to get under your skin. Yeah, so cause know. she liked it over here. You know, I'm basic. I'm like super cool. Like all that shit was just meant to get. It under was a your Google skin. image. Even the no. Even the that was in the tits. I think. I was jealous no. a little bit. All that shit was strategic just to get under your skin, just so you know. Everything. She's That's like, what I think, too. Oh, the chain. Oh, the... Di- bro, girls know what they're doing. Yeah. It's, it's never I'm still invited to the live show, though. It's the devil's work. <laughs> it's the devil's work, bro. Yeah. The yeah. devil's been working overtime in our love lives. The devil's Except been working Except guys. You guys are amazing. Like, yesterday, uh, Letty and Jorge called me. They're together. I was like, oh, I wish I could be me. <laughs> we did. Why did we call you? Uh, to confirm some surprises we have for the live show. And... and why Let's just say, I feel like we should just say. Wait, be, my brain is going blank. Um, Because remember, uh, Yoshinoya was supposed to come tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Oh, Vic doesn't know. What? Yoshinoya DM me on TikTok. Shut yeah. the fuck yeah. up. And, and Jorge is crazy. Hold so, on. Jorge is like, crazy. He don't care about nothing but Yoshinoya at 9 a.m. Yeah. I, I realized that yesterday. He said, are you psycho like me and eat Yoshinoya at 9 a.m.? And I was, I was like, like, when he said that, I had just found a secret of my husband that he eats Yoshinoya yeah, at 9 a.m. He doesn't tell nobody? <laughs> no. <laughs> that's what's like. <laughs> But Juno's like, I will go more towards 11 a.m. But I'm like, wait, Yoshinoya in the morning? I didn't even know it opened that early. Fucking crazy. Me fucking either. He, he, he put me on that and I looked it up. It opened at 8. The freshest. Yeah. There's that, a Yoshinoya by the crib. Yeah, yeah that's a Juno that's loves Yoshinoya. Yeah. We all love I Yoshinoya. Love, I remember no, the No, y'all shit it on Yoshinoya. Let's run the fucking clip back. Yeah, the episode. Because Yoshinoya it was just bashing me. on me. No, I was with you, dog. You were with me. You were fucking it. Yeah. Oh, 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 no. We right. love Yoshino. We all love Yoshino. <laughs> it's okay. If they know, they know. No, no. So they watch the clip. <laughs> yes. And they DM me. And then um, uh, we usually, from on Tuesday, we moved it to Monday because we're doing some stuff on Tuesday. So they were supposed to come tomorrow. And, yeah. and they DM me and they're like, bro, we saw the clip. We love how you love Yoshino. Like, That's fine. And, and I, they sent me an email. Um, for some reason, they had DM me, but it wasn't letting me accept so I, I had to get the email and then reply to the girl and just hit her through her personal She's page. Cool too. Mm-hmm. And we connected with her and they and they wanted to come and bring us your Shinoya. Out of that, I also like your Shinoya. Yes, yes, yes. Was just it, about it, it, it is true. Letty was one of the ones that was because yeah. Jiz yeah. was judging me. Irene was definitely judging yeah. me. Vic was definitely Yoshinoya judging is me. Top tier. But but then they called me because I was telling Letty about some. We have a special surprise guest and doing some stuff. Oh, got you, got yes, you. Yes, yes. And then Jorge, like, he didn't even care about what we were talking about. He was just like, he's, to hear about he's like, fool, you like Yoshinoya? I'm like, bro, I could eat that shit every day. And he's like, do you eat at 9 a.m.? And I was like, I'm really more of an 11 a.m., 12 p.m. type of guy. It was the Lunch. weirdest conversation I've ever like, seen. And that fool's like, nah, fool, I eat it with the construction workers. Yeah, that was That's funny. funny. <laughs> it's, like, it's me and the but construction workers at 9 a.m. eating fucking Yoshinoya. If you pay attention to things, there's always a Yoshinoya by a Home Depot because it's oh. as Latino you like obviously it's Japanese for right. quote unquote but <laughs> people love chicken and rice I can eat chicken and rice every day yeah. yeah. so that's I thought that was funny and that is funny. Jorge does come from that background of like construction workers yeah I'm, I don't know what his parents do he's up really early but that fool's just beating it out you know yeah. and then, that's what my mom is <laughs> he's ultimate and, and then so that fool was like I was like you eat Yoshinoya at 9 a.m. Mm-hmm. Cause you're I'm trying to picture Jorge pulling up at 9 a.m. When, in in okay. secret. Apparently so in secret, like, so nobody sees. So the- this is what he does. He drops the boys off, 750. Go gets his um, nails done at the, like, in, in our area, there's, like, a shopping center. Gets nails. After the nails, goes to Yoshinoya, then goes to work. I'm wondering if Letty's ever, like, I've never knew about that until right me. now. 
And that's what that Yoshinoya I'm like Yoshinoya the construction workers <laughs> That's sad me dad But yeah so uh, we, we hope to see Yoshinoya very soon They're gonna come to the pod yeah. Yeah, They fine. were very excited They loved the clip They were like Bro we fuck with you there. You guys are amazing Yeah And now Back then you couldn't DM on TikTok Unless you guys followed each other Oh Now you can Now you can send three messages Yeah so now I was like Oh and then I, I've been going through my shit And that's where I got the girls Oh you saw like the, the girls sent me, And it was from like Requested messages Hella weeks ago And I felt terrible but when I DM'd her, she still replied. She followed up, and I was like, "Oh, perfect." You DM'd her on TikTok. Uh yeah, she has DM me, and then I replied, and then she sent me the email and her personal, and then their IG. Oh, yeah. okay. So that was dope. So shout I've out. Been, I've been emailing with her. Yeah, yeah so shout out Yoshinoya. That's dope. You guys are amazing. We we shout helped out, out Yoshinoya. Guys. But yeah, that full Jorge City Yoshinoya at nine a.m. I was like, that's yeah. fucking wild. That shit was crazy. <laughs> I didn't know people ate that early. Like he does. People eat that early. He's on a crazy program right now for the marathon. Dude, you fools are on this six. <laughs> that fool's crazy. running six miles, fool. You guys, he gets obsessive, but I like it. Like this obsessive that he's right now for the marathon, I'm like, it's inspiring me. Because to him, he's like, all right, we're doing the marathon. Um, the Neighborhood Knit Foundation Marathon in Puma, they're all like partnering on the actual LA marathon, That's which is fire. cool, like That's first full circle. Yeah. yeah. And he's literally like logging in miles. I see miles, six miles for somebody that doesn't run often at a all. And you got to like think in that one hour, he did six miles of running. He did the laundry at the laundromat. He washed the car and then he did the six miles. Wow. Jeez. Like that fool is like crazy and he wants to beat the Kenyans. Like he literally is watching YouTube videos of the Kenyans working out because Kenyans like run the yeah. marathon. Like, yeah. But me and my sister, my sister who runs a lot too, she's like, I told Jorge, they've been, the Kenyans have been training their whole life to do this. Like they've been training since a little kid. Yeah, yeah, Jorge facts. just started training a couple months ago. But Jorge said this shit and his confidence is insane. He's like, they've been training their whole life. It's in my DNA. He's like, I'm an Aztec. I'm, I'm from Mexico. How do you think we made the pyramids? That shit other people think aliens did it in Egypt. We did that shit. Like, and the way he talks, I'm like, I want to fucking run right now. <laughs> <laughs> like, whoa, you're fucking right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see? He needs to be like a Tony Robbins. Aztec warrior. <laughs> no <laughs> warriors, <laughs> dude. <laughs> that's what, that's what, that's what, that's what running with wings on his ankles. That's what they get no more. He's running with wings on his ankles. Yes. Yes. <laughs> to him, Namor. to him, Namor is history. Yeah, yes. no, no. Uh, yeah. So I, I, but it, it was funny because I know he's been like on the like workout vibes, already, yeah. like yeah. already like getting toned and shit. Mm -hmm. But bro, people don't understand like Kenyans are amazing. Yeah, at and running. I told like, him I'm like watch till watch till like it's race day and you see just their leg, like the fucking span. That they can run. Bro, and, and he's like, and watch till they see me. And he's like, it's going to be on the news. Mexican beats the Kenyans. <laughs> First then, ever marathon. Then, dude, like, for, for, he's, he's up there with it. But it takes that to do some shit. Yeah, like, facts, you facts. Know? And there's, uh, there's this white dude on TikTok that I watch. And he goes like running with the best. And he and he gives an update on his mm -hmm. on his like TikTok. Mm -hmm. when, when they're going up a certain altitude, they change their pace. Their wow. breathing, like their their breathing I, strategy. Send me that so I could send it and to him. And that food's fucking. And the Kenyans are just like smiling. It's like kind of like it's kind of. I was talking to my sister. They train like they do twenty miles a day. That's already three fourths of the marathon. The marathon is twenty six yeah. miles. I'm like they do marathons to train for the marathon. Right. Yeah. Damn, far. Like, think it's a trip. How many miles do you think you could do? Like let's just five k. You do a five k. That's easy. three miles. You One. now struggle. One man. You could you got more in you. You got more in you. What about then you can also walk a little bit. We're like just pace yourself. Second wind. What about know. if I might right next to you? You're so stupid. It's 26. <laughs> <laughs> the right dang, dangle the carrot. Yeah, exactly. Uh -huh. How many do you could do? Uh I like probably 10 before I literally am out. But I like running. I love running. I'm started getting back into running. Yeah. I that's my favorite mm. workout. I'm two blocks in. Two, no, you're no, not. But look, you're good. I could swim but, probably for 26 miles. Okay, but, hey, Greg, but I didn't believe you could swim. Oh, Greg, but, I'll beat you in swimming. But do not, but you're running next to a BBL. Hey. And she, she won't, she won't yeah. give it up unless Chase you... Chase her for two blocks. You run for uh, the cops for more than two unless blocks. Unless you make it to like, you know... Oh, no, I'm a hider. You're a hider? You're I'm not riding, a hider? just... <laughs> just <laughs> this is like, bro, like I've been hiking to where... Shut the Fuck with up. the baddie and, Dude, and I threw up halfway. I never told you guys. When I'm I, not gonna do that normally if she's not there. I, I never told you guys when I was when we me and Nami got caught tagging. I had just came back from I'm my a hider. from 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 <laughs> from fucking on my knee really bad mm -hmm. with the moped accident. 
So I ran like five steps and my knee just gave out. Oh. All the homies were, because the one of the homies, he wasn't fucking, he was talking to other homies. So we, so, we, so we got <laughs> caught. So we got <laughs> caught because this one wasn't paying attention. And the other homies, but the other homies are like fit. They were like high school football players and like, and he just jumped the fence and took off. I fucked up my whole knee like a month before. So my knee was barely recovering and that shit just gave out like two shit. blocks in K-Town and they were just like, Freeze. And I was like, you got me, bitch. I couldn't move no more. And then I went to jail for tagging, but that shit was hilarious. But, and then I learned, I was like, maybe I'm just a hider. And I'm a good hider. What are the tips to hiding? <laughs> the pole? Like, yes. You find a bush or you don't, find a... Don't do like the, the, the super burned out. Like, don't do the obvious. You know, people are going to look at trash cans. Under the cars. Wow. Under the cars. And sometimes under the car does work. Cars are lazy. They won't. Wow. Yeah, it does work. They, so yeah, what do you do? I've been under a car. I've... I usually, okay, one, you don't want to go anywhere to where when you come out, it's going to look like you were hiding. So I've hit in like some super like normal, like I've done this one, bro. I swear to God, my mom and the cops came. There was a chair right next to me. I literally just sat on the chair and did this on my phone and the cops just ran right by me. I swear <laughs> to God. Because so I, I, like you cartoon being regular. I swear <laughs> to God. That's a fucking cartoon scene. <laughs> he has a newspaper. <laughs> 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 That's fucking you're like they went that way. But you're like <laughs> Hid- hiding in plain sight. No, no, because I didn't run. <laughs> That's bold as fuck. Just <laughs> he went like, hey, I was like, hey. He went That's that funny. way, sir. He went that way. I'm like, I hid in some bushes when I shoplifted before. And the cops went went by. That was cool. Yeah, but that was fucking yeah, but yeah, there's there's people like let the you could damn near hide anywhere. But I wouldn't need to. Yeah, facts. Don't break the law. I'm just saying, like, <laughs> if we ever decided to do it all three as a team. Or all, all three us, as a team? All three ever, as a team, we commit a crime for yeah. what? I don't what know. What are we doing? Maybe we rob La Platica. <laughs> 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 we should go hide at Ultra. Oh, no, they'll catch his ass. At Ultra? Oh, is that Ultra? Ultra's the beer? <laughs> Shut up. Oh, God. <laughs> They catch you straight. How did they catch you straight? I don't know. I was just, they're the homies. That's why. Yeah, they're good to, sports. They're, they're shout out to La Platica. I, old. <laughs> I feel like <laughs> we're just oh. hiding the beer in the beer in the beer things. Oh shit! You're so stupid. Dude, shout That's out. Funny as fuck. Can you help me with this little blanket? Hey, do, do you ever see people drink certain things and you're like, ah, pussy? Hey, by the way, Te Salud, incredible. They yeah, the shout out. Yeah, shout, shout out, Josh. I seen that he did like. 13 million sales recently. Let's wow. go. So, That's shout crazy. out Brown Excellence over there. Started his own Hell brand. Yeah. Decided to go his own route. We got to give it up to him, man. I like that shit. I still have some at the crib. Yeah, my, save me last no, time. No, they have oh, a sick. new one. They, it got sent to my house because I'm part Bye. of the influencer. Hey. Do you know I don't what? know how I got a part of that. I don't deserve it. Um, But... There's like they have like a sleepy one, like a chamomile oh, or Montana. Bro, that's the one. Bro, my mom likes the yeah. the calm the mm-hmm. the calm one. She she takes it. Yeah, yeah, cause cause my, bro, my mom's been like, see how I'm putting her business out there. My mom's been like bleeding <laughs> a lot lately, oh. and Can you she up? like, bro, I'll be like, bro, you gotta go to a specialist and check this out. Mm. Oh, by the way, Angie says she doesn't want Marcus in the back of of. Of the, oh, she left. Yeah, of the green room. Um, what? He's not allowed. He's not no, gonna get all just, access. No, just she's like not sure. Yeah. Why? I don't know. I would. Me and me and Vic were trying to like. Well, she said she doesn't like. She want to be responsible for him. In, yeah, in like a good her way. Mind will be on him. And like she wants to make sure he's good, but like she has to like work and shit. Like which might as well just give him a seat in the audience. Yeah. I don't. That's different for me because I feel like Jorge gets all access and. Yeah, well, yeah. Just wanders on. Yeah. yeah, but 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 I feel like. I feel like it's I feel a little like, different because he doesn't like. Well, Jorge is also in the business. Yeah, but so like nobody, nobody knows. Like, like I remember, I, like Jorge was there, pool. and I didn't see him till I saw him drinking champagne with you, and I was like, "Oh, hi." <laughs> <laughs> hey there, bud. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, I feel like I feel like I feel like they'll be good. Yeah, yeah I think I think Marcus should be back there. Yeah. 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 yeah I feel like I think she be. doesn't want him to end up on stage. He doesn't want him around the desmadre. Yeah. She wants Damn, to protect we should, him. We should bring that for on stage. Oh my god! That's literally what she's probably hey, afraid and you of. And you don't watch the episodes like that, so let's let's oh, plot. Oh, and force them to make out. Mm-hmm. Yes. Whoa. What? Sick. We man. should have them do. You like guys a- tried to make me kiss my baby mama last time. Yeah, but that wasn't different. me. <laughs> you guys. Yeah. Uh, shout out Ali. Yes. Yeah, but no. <laughs> Dude, you making out with your baby mama is crazy. No, the crazy stage. part is that his son was in the 
audience. That's what Bali is. Jimmy Bali came true. No, he was like, she doesn't want to. <laughs> Little Vic was screaming, she doesn't want to. <laughs> Damn, hey, everyone did her, did her new man saw the episode? He was probably like, what the fuck? I don't know. Can we do something Christmas related? Because this has this is our Christmas episode. Feliz Navidad. Let's just say Feliz Navidad real quick. Feliz Navidad. Feliz Navidad. Yo espero. Prospero año. Yo prospero año y felicidad. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas. I wanna wish you a Merry Christmas from the bottom. And oh my heart. heart. Fucking weak ass bitches. Stop posting the muggly ass kids on your story. That's what he don't give a fuck about. I have to get that out of my chest. Feliz my sister was posting the weak ass nephews I got. You love your nephews. Weak as fuck. Can't even sing. Oh, like doing their. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All <laughs> oh, the voices this week. So get the ready. The performance? Did Wednesday. Did Lil, Vic did a, Lil Vic did a Vic? No, I, I was on air. But Lil Vic did a performance and uh, I picked him up after school and he was mad as fuck. That you didn't go. No, 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 no. No, he was mad that some girls weren't paying attention that were like part of the performance and they messed everybody up and like threw it off. He's like, there was these girls that like, they didn't know what they were doing and they messed us all up. I can't believe it. Our, our performance would have been perfect. Like yeah. it, he was hot like that they weren't paying attention. He's like, like, I paid attention, dad. I knew all the words. Nobody else did. Yeah, yeah he was Damn. mad. Yeah, yeah was I have a, uh, Angelina. She's like very serious. Does the one. Your niece. She's like, like, I don't want to be with nobody. I want to go home. And, like, so her performance is, like, just you see her mouth Aww, moving. Oh, baby And then girl. Aiden's, like. <laughs> I can't wait to see the boys. They have, Jorito's been practicing one about snowflakes. Oh. I think it's, like, a snowflake song. I've never heard it. Like, it's, like. It's probably one of the new joints. A different one. But, like, he's doing the. Oh, yeah. The, yeah, cool. he's practicing. I'm excited for it. Shout the out to The innocence of kids and, like, yeah. doing those performances. How was Emmys? Awesome. Emmys is cool. She's she, in choir. She did. She's like, just didn't look at us. She's like, don't look at me. And I was messing with her. I was like, Emmy, that's my daughter. And she's like, she looked at me like, stop it, stop it. Like, we're good. <laughs> so I kept doing it. Yeah, that's that's, that's like a vibe. And Max is just, he's happy. He's just like following yeah. the teacher, doing the dance moves. <laughs> yeah, that's how that's how Aiden is. Aiden's like, he stole the show. He went like in front and just started doing hey. stupid shit. Yeah, I missed it though. I was supposed to go. I had to film a vlog. Should have filmed Dude, the vlog no. of you going Boy, that to that for once a fucking cool Christmas gift. That shit's expensive. The vlog should have been going to his thing. Oh, yeah. Nah, because then you got to, like, I don't want to record other kids. True. You know what I'm saying? But but he but he, but, but he was great. He was great. Remember on his birthday when, or Juan Duno's birthday when his nephew said all he wants is to play with Duno? Oh, yeah. Did he get his birthday wish yet? Fuck no. <laughs> My niece is starting to wear Proclam. She kind of scared me. Why? That's what she wants for Christmas, the Proclam box. I'm like, why do you want a pro club box? What's wrong with that? She probably sees you wearing and thinks it's cool. Yeah, but she wants like the sweats and like. Let's show that out. Let's get it for free, bro. Imagine you got a little chola. No, not necessarily. Yeah? It's if it's baggy. Yeah, style her. Yeah. Can't even style myself. (laughs) (laughs) You guys know what you're going to wear for the live show already? No. I have no fucking idea. And I'm like, fuck, you always got everything together. You have you guys don't like to plan and it's annoying me. Prep is the key. Prep, prep, yeah. prep, so that you can. Are you just wearing? Are you wearing the one? The one that you sent us? I have a couple that I'm actually thinking. Oh, about. you added more. I have a couple to choose from. Mm. Dang. The I only thing go- that's stopping me is I really want to wear a dress. <laughs> but but we sit down. Yes, 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 yes. That is very true. Yeah. Um, I think I'm gonna go with some ex- um, custom made none of them. Yeah. Support the boys' brand. That's fine. Yeah. Then Aaron Peasy been killing us, so I think I'm gonna go with some exclusive none of some jacket and jeans. I feel like last year we were not festive. We did. We we were like we a, were we not were, festive. We were regular. We yeah. were vibe. But I feel like we need to be festive. I wanted to feel like they're coming over our house mm. for Christmas time. I was thinking of getting some red jeans, which is like I I'm would. not mad at that. Look, come festive. Yeah, come yeah. festive to the live show because it's supposed to be that. Like, like it's the, lit. yeah, it's just a, like you guys are watching Christmas, the Mean Girls. Is it Christmas that you want to have? Yes, I definitely thought about White Air Forces. Um, maybe they like Suge Knight a little bit, and then All you know, red? but but like customize it with like the Nana Sum. Like okay. get some Nana Sum done, and maybe wear like a red hat. That's dope. Or maybe even wear just like Ooh, a Christmas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like a Christmas hat. Ooh, I like that. That's yeah, so dope. I like the vibes been out. But it's honestly like certain colors, and obviously I'm bigger, so I gotta find like the exact size. Mm-hmm. I think I found the jeans though. 
I like that. Yeah, so I'm I'm trying to just go very, or I might go red and green. Okay, yeah. just depends. But red and green, like like this green is very dope. I love this green. Right, yeah, it's this green Christmas is this, fucking green. Christmas green. Yeah, this green is probably the best green. Shout out to Adidas. I literally would not have gotten this, but it, it's like so vibes. It's vibes. It's definitely vibes. Yeah. Yeah. So I'm like I'm like debating on what's the vibe I'm going with. Yeah, I have no clue yet. You have no clue. What about you? No, no idea. Probably gonna wear some shit that you told us you were gonna get us, but not get us. Possibly. Let's. Why don't we introduce Yaelin? Oh yeah. Do you want to? I, start I think the audience. The audience has seen Yaelin before, actually, when she first came to give us spooky baskets. Yes. At oh the yeah. Po- at the blue wall. Yeah, the blue wall. Yaelin is our new assistant producer. She's gonna be helping. Yeah. Maximo. Yeah. 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 She has Maximo. Cocaine. <laughs> Yaelin, how old are you? I am 19. 19 years old. Jeez. You sound great, by the way. Thank you. 19 and working very hard. We got introduced to how, <laughs> Yaelin? Um, by Vic. Me and Vic, I feel like, connected like a, maybe like a year and a half ago. Yeah. LA Taco. You DM me and then you were talking about like, oh, I want to do a story about Brown Bag for LA Taco. Yeah, right? and it never came out, yes. unfortunately. <laughs> Yeah, she scammed us, <laughs> y'all. Things happen. Things happen. Yeah, Dang, I finessed my way, and no, I'm kidding. Yeah, she no. brought in some spooky baskets for all of us. Yes. Like yeah. last year, yeah. it was really nice. Yes, and then we have a lot of plans for 2024. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. But yeah. Yaelene is here. She's part of the crew. Say hi to Yaelene. What's your Instagram? It's my name, Y A I L E E N, with two N's. Yeah. And what should we not about the name Yaelene? Do you know? Oh, because I, like Yaelene's the first Yaelene I met. True. And then there's Yaelene, the 6'9 mm-hmm. Yaelene. Yeah, then she's there's viral. Like, there's so many Yaelines now. And I feel like it's a new Aiden, but all these no, Yaelines I think are older. I think it's like, you know when um, you yeah. want something or like when you finally get introduced to it and you're like, oh my God, I have never seen like a blue Kia. And now, and you, now see, you, all you see, see is blue Kias. Kias. Mm. It's like Vic's Tesla. Yeah. I feel like that's no, what it is. No, but like now all we see is Yaelines because we got introduced to that, her. I think that's yeah. what it is. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Probably, for like Vic's girls, we get introduced and that's how we see them. Oh, so I, I I tend to stay away from Vicks girls. I, I, I noticed that, yeah. yeah. I that? My what do you do? I feel like Yaelin would be like, I'm not talking to you because I you might that. not be here next week. I do that, actually. She I definitely think, speaks her mind. I definitely do that just because I feel like... Well, also, they don't like you. Yeah, they don't like me. Oh, I forgot. They don't like me. But You are behind one of Vicks breakups. I, not like that, I, but I've learned. Yeah, I've yeah, come yeah, to no, learn. No, you, we gotta like break it down. I get what you're yeah, saying. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yaelene is like Vic's little sister. Yeah, mm-hmm. essentially. And a girl that he was talking to that loves to pray um, got upset. God, that, God or God? God. God both. It's God. double entendre. <laughs> got upset that Vic dropped Yaelene off somewhere. Yeah. Where did you drop me off? At your house. Oh, yeah, you did. But like, no, it was just that like, we 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 worked. <gasps> Wait, when we worked was together it? After the I last live show, episode. <gasps> yeah, she she yeah. knows the cheese man. Yeah, it was just like it's like dude, I look at like in my mind like this is just yeah. Yaelene. Like she's like mm-hmm. I'm sorry, like she's not a girl to me. Like in the way I yeah. think yeah, of that, like I, you know oh, what I'm saying? Unfortunately, unfortunately, do you want to be a girl to him? No, no, nah, I just, not what she's saying. No, it's like um, <laughs> like <laughs> like to me, Vic isn't a guy. I think he's just Vic. <laughs> Well, you get what we're okay, saying? Okay, so like, you guys are Barbies. Neither of you have private parts. We get it. We get it. <laughs> I think he's Barbie and I'm Ken. We're, like, yeah, I think, whatever it is. <laughs> like, he's very much more yeah. like Barbie. So, yeah, so, like, there's a woke relationship. <laughs> yeah, so, <it's> like, <laughs> we're Latinx in here. No, so, Latin. like, basically, I'm, like, the same way I wouldn't, like, if I had a girlfriend, I wouldn't tell her, like, yo, I'm hanging out with Sal Trees or I'm hanging out with Swift. Like, to me, it yeah. doesn't matter that I'm hanging out with Yaelene. It's I not it. a girl to me. Yaelene is your Duno for me because Duno is not a guy to me. He's like, you know oh, it's Duno. Like, me and my husband yeah. can fucking face You're definitely Duno. a woman to me. Yeah. <laughs> 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 okay. Well. This one is not double standard like that. <laughs> oh, okay. This one is one way. <laughs> we both used to turn around this bitch. <laughs> 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 yeah. Uh, we drive on the wrong side of the, the street. Juice, the juice. <laughs> Right. Oh, yeah, but basically, man. but to you, Yaelene is like it's not like She's, oh the opposite sex. No, it's, more it's like, like someone Yaelene, I work sis. with, little sis, mm-hmm. little sister. Yeah, 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 I, I work that. with very closely. Yeah. I have so much love for. Her. Like I look at her like my protege. You know, like wow. And so it's like with that, I'm just like I don't imagine that I would have to notify my girl someone else yeah, that yeah, I'm yeah. hanging out with her. And like the girl I was dating at the time was like, why don't you tell me you're hanging out with another girl? I'm like, it's not another girl. It's not girl. another girl. It's Yaelene. You know? And exactly. Then it's, yeah. And Yaelene is that. very, like, if you yeah. were to meet her and you guys will know her more, Yaelene is not, like, in any way, like, threatening. Mm-hmm. 
Yeah. yeah Aileen is literally, she's going to ask 5,000 questions. Yeah. She's going to talk a lot. 5,000 one. She's going to, like, like everything, like, like this, that's Aileen. And her but, first intention is to get along with people. But it's not threatening. Yeah. It's not like, oh, I don't I even want. threaten myself. Like, I never, like, feel so like. So, did, did you meet the girl? Yeah, so. So they the, met, but yeah. it, there was still but, like. But, my but thing they met, is, but she was mad that. But my oh, thing is. Oh, she was already a little if, butthurt about the meeting. Mm. But I, the thing is that you dropped me off after the live show. You guys were both. I'm a, you guys were both drunk, kind of, right? <laughs> no, no, not big. No. I wasn't driving. Actually. No, you were. Yeah. Because this is what I she remember. Was driving. I was Officer. supposed to. I was supposed to <laughs> drive. <laughs> <laughs> drive. I was supposed to drive. Remember? Yes, and then yeah, I yeah. got scared. <laughs> yeah. And then you ended up in the back seat, and I ended up in the front with her. Exactly. And were you guys bonding? We were, we were talking. She was like talking That's about the God. Worst. When she talks to you, and then and you then get out of the car. Who the fuck was that? Why the fuck you so close? And then she was like, "I'll invite you on the podcast." Remember, she told me, "Do you want to come on the podcast?" She goes, you're so, you're so motivational. You have such a great story. Fake. <gasps> Judas, I'm going to call you out. <laughs> Judas. Whoa. And, that's why you, and that's why you're high. Yaelene, Yaelene does have a great story, by the way. My baby girl has been through a lot. Yeah. Where, what city you at? East LA. East hey. Los. She's great at what she does. I like, I like your energy and your enthusiasm for stuff. She loves Fuck. boxing, so me and her vibe on mm-hmm. that. Um, yeah, that's kind of scary that you guys are both really obsessed with boxing. She's an America, America fan. Yeah, we just won. Yes. And yes. Henry, I, I love you, you by the way. What did you do? What do you mean we won? We won. I supported <laughs> him since they won. Yeah, I supported yeah. him since they won. <laughs> you, you know what? That's crazy. They're definitely playing Barcelona. Henry, Martin, I love you. You're, you're, I love you very much. Mm-hmm. Miguel Ayun, if you're watching this, I love you. You're you, so cute. I love you so much. She's so, so I so cried. Cute. I cried this morning because I realized that we won. She probably really did cry. No, I did. I cried. Yeah, so I'm, you know what, Eileen? What number one rule to podcasting? Don't ever chew your fucking gum again. I'm so sorry. You're chewing gum? Yes, wow. terrible fucking rule. We eat food, we fucking do all this shit, but Eileen can't chew gum? I know. No. No. <laughs> <laughs> but you know what? We're happy to have you here. Yeah. Love you to death. Um, please don't ruin any other Vic relationships. He's depressed and sad and wants to kill himself. No, I know. I, I honestly feel bad, but that's why I, no. I say Judas. I never get to, I never get like, now I've learned my lesson not to get like too close to them because I thought we were friends yeah do you follow yeah. her see no, look what you I, did you fuck face I, I, I didn't me? I didn't follow her can't believe you Vic was but they me? had a good yeah. conversation and when Yaelin opens up to someone they're genuinely friends yeah yeah so I thought we were friends but yeah. this is why I take Vic's side every time yeah shit well, happens tampoco no I do because yeah, like does. I really do <laughs> because I'm like I just don't ever yeah, I've know definitely, I've definitely heard Yaelin give Vic advice and I'm like because I don't ever know what they're act- what the girls are talking about me. Years old. 19 yeah, I'm 20 <laughs> next month. By the way, guys. <laughs> Your birthday's in January. That's a fake ass birthday. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> we officially have our youngest member, you guys. Yeah. A- yeah. Oh, brother. I remember yeah, I went, I went to like Hooters for my 20th birthday, and then I was all excited. I was with the should homies. we go to Old Locos for a birthday? We bit? should. That'd be ah. good. So they told the girl, the server. No, they but were you like, can go. Oh. They told the server, like, oh, it's his 20th birthday. Yeah, he wants to go look at some ass. I was so cool. <laughs> I know. Crazy. What's your type? <laughs> Boxing? Yes, and I think we've talked about yeah. this. Like, oh, you guys had like a, like a big shit, little shit moment about... She, no, she told the, me who her boxing crushes. No, crush I didn't is. say... She has weird ass crushes. Yeah. Who's your boxing crush? Be quiet. <laughs> Be quiet. I, don't even, I can't even name any of them, but I'm just like... This doofus, like, okay, and none of them look alike either. It's okay, but you make none fun of her. Of me for don't talk about Benavides like that, okay? <gasps> he no, won't oh. fight. That's no, crazy. I, I can't even remember. No, who, I but like, it all be Oscar like, Delonia. Ooh. no, she'll tell me, like, this is like, this is my crush. <laughs> Four different people, completely <laughs> different, different looking. I'm like, what are you even Because I sent him Harry Styles things, and then, oh, I'll, yeah, and then I'll be like, oh my god, look at Travis Kelsey, and then he'll be like, okay, and then I forgot who I sent you one time, not Travis Kelsey, yeah. She said this. All right. Nice to, <laughs> nice to introduce you Bye to the everybody. crew. Bye, everybody. Imagine being like mad at Ayeli. That's crazy. You can't. She's a little sweetheart. She's yeah. just like, I know, like but she's like, still learning life. Yeah. I know. We're all adults. The fuck shit we do is on purpose. Mm-hmm. Her fuck shit is just, oh, I'm sorry. Learning. Like, yeah. yeah, it's learning. Yeah, learning. Yeah. Yes. Don't you know I'm local? Southwest Airlines is now giving free seats to fatties. I'm there. <laughs> <laughs> I've seen that. They're but that motivated me. Overweight people can get a, uh, a free seat no at Southwest. No wonder says flying to Oregon this, this, this year. <laughs> By the way, me and Jose have very dark humor. <laughs> Another dark humor. We're talking about a management thing, and we're we're saying like the abbreviations of it, and then we ask Irene, and then I said like Irene only knows BBC. <laughs> but yes, Southwest Airlines. Yes, I'm 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 glad. Have you flown Juno, and had to buy another seat? 
No. Good. No, no, he just smashed me to the side. I'm like, I'm like yeah, we've all flown. We've flown so many places together. First of all, bro. Wait, you You're a dick. Wait, you smashed That him? was back from London. Because w- that was when Duno was in another Can aisle. I get, for, was it because I didn't want to be lonely with like two old ass people that decided to sit next to my friend? He complained the whole time. Yeah. I, didn't I, wanted, to, I wanted you to sit next to me. I didn't complain. Why did you sit next to me? He said you guys were rubbing so like, close that you're going to start a fire. And I had an open seat, so we could have like had the middle. No, it was weird times. And I used uh, doing the shoulder as a as a pillow. Yeah, all that complaining, but motherfucker was snoring for four hours on my shoulder. <laughs> Next time, fuck you, Maximum. Put your head on, on my, my shoulder. shoulder. Oh yeah, Damn. we've gotten to the singing part of this episode. We're out. <laughs> We're gone. Yeah. So that's so. Uh, yeah. Um. I've never. I'm blessed. I definitely had to hide the the seatbelt before. <laughs> no way. <laughs> yeah, for sure. For sure. What about using the restroom? Was that hard? No, 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 no. I'm big like... Boy, big Boy told me... Shout out, Big Boy. Big Boy? He told me to get a bottle cap. He would get a bottle cap. You know the button that lets you go back? Yeah. Put it there so that it doesn't accidentally push the button because he would be that big. He was overweight. He was really, really overweight. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like 300 plus pounds. That he would put a bottle cap on the button so that it wouldn't go back on him. Oh, because you know how the button goes for the plane. Like, oh. Yeah, on the plane. Then I have to find live hacks. Then see, like, yeah, that's like, that's crazy. Yeah, yeah, I mean, yeah, he was, he was, yeah, big. Mm-hmm. yeah. I seen, I seen, I seen like old photos of him recently, mm-hmm. actually, mm-hmm. and that was big compared to how he looks now. Yeah. yeah, I'm like, holy shit. Yeah, but yeah, no, but I think that's cool. That Southwest is doing that. It might be a little, and they're not even like buying it. I think they just get like an extra sheet for free. Yeah, but also, like, let's be honest. Like I'm big. I've always been big. But, like, being healthy is another thing. Like, I definitely want to live for a very long time. You know what I'm saying? So, like, I'm, like, I'm, like, I went through a lot of shit this, like, last two months to where, like, I stopped going to the gym and I was, like, in a really good rhythm where I felt like I hit, like, a little spot where I was, like, I wasn't losing weight because I have to, like, shock my body again. Mm -hmm. And I was back to it. But then, like, my little homie ended up passing away and I just, a a lot of different things, right? And we're traveling a lot. Mm -hmm. We're traveling. I was, like, doing the whole Figmunity World thing. So I just wasn't in, like, yeah. in my rhythm. And low-key, don't feel bad about that, especially if you're going through that, too, because it's the holidays. Yes, 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 not, yes. It's yeah. irregular scheduling. Yeah. Yeah. Facts. We're going to get back into regular schedule come January, so, like, don't be too hard on yourself. For yeah, that. so yeah. I was definitely, like, feeling really good. Um, And, yeah, I was feeling really good, but then uh, today I went to the gym again, and I felt good as fuck. Like, I felt, like, That's energized. Good. And having my own spa makes me a little more lazy. Mm. Yeah. So I'm wow. like, everything yeah. is, is an adjustment. In it's life, a good though. and a bad thing because I've been saving a lot of money because I'm not going out. Yeah. Been saving a lot of money. Cause you don't wanna, you don't have like the urge to leave. You're yeah, in a comfort zone. Yeah, because it's not like it's not like if my mom has her friends over and I'll sleep in the living room, I'm like, okay, I gotta go. You know, like yeah. I just want to like so it's one of those things too. But it's dope. It's dope. Been saving a lot of money, been at the crib, been really like, I feel like I feel like this year around, I was like. It was kind of like a big phase in my life to where, like, all right, for you kind of got to become an adult. Yeah. And it was, like, Jeez. one of those things. And losing somebody that was, like, so young and, like, full of life and joy, it was, yeah. like, that shit, like, generally, like, broke my heart yeah. to the sense to where I'm, like, like, you know, like, I'm kind of looking at life a little different yeah. now. Well, and, you've and, you've and, been through so much Yeah, yeah, year. and, 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 and if we're in a really good way, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So, But, yeah, man, I'm, I'm, I'm blessed. But I've been at back at the gym. It felt good, fool. Like, I woke up this morning and I was, like, you got to go, fool. Tight. You got to oh, go. Yeah. And I went and that shit felt good as fuck. Like, I was like, I felt good. I was I was energized. It felt dope. It was cool. Big vibes. Big vibes. Big vibes. But that is crazy. That is crazy. The Southwest shit, I don't know how that's going to like, it's, oh. it's crazy because if like somebody's super duper huge, like, I'm not saying don't live your life and eat with you, but just, you know, keep in mind that blood clocks and like heart stop, stoppage and shit like that, you can really die. Mama. That's real shit. The older you can you die. Yeah. It's kind of like, you can have fun and go drink every day, but that takes a credit. It takes a tax on you. Yeah, mm-hmm. so you know, just just be mindful and and if uh, bro, I've been meeting people somehow that have that one surgery, lap band, where they fucking could eat minimal, like gastric they, bypass. Gastric bypass. Gastric. Yes, and I was like, what the fuck? So you yeah. can't eat the same? My big boy, big boys like that too. And he got it when it was like new, yeah. so it's probably like the worst kind. Like he got the most extreme kind, and literally like what it does is. Now whatever you eat, it the food, the ca- no, but the calories don't go to you. But neither do the nutrients. So he has to be constantly pumping himself with like nutrients and and stuff like that 
because if he eats something, se le va. Like, it just passes right yeah, through. Yeah, so. Yeah. Yeah, but shout out to everybody living their life. But just be mindful. Be careful. Go on a walk. Go on a run. Mm -hmm. That's just good for the body. You get energized. Wake up. I love running. Drink some aguita. Aguita. Drink some water. Y no te aguites. Y no te aguites. <laughs> maybe eat. Why, if you get your shinoya, maybe eat the broccoli with it. Yeah, yeah, eat the veggies, eat the yeah. eat the 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 cabbage. Yeah, and if you like, guess eat some fajitas if you can't eat it by itself. Yeah. So yeah, that's, that's like a lot of things you can do. Brown back shout out. Woo! Yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, I was at Target in Alhambra, and I was like at the Ulta section, and it's funny because I was like looking for stuff, and and this girl comes up to me, and at Ulta at Target they have it like super secure. Not because Ultra, people Ulta. I said Ulta. I know. I'm just saying. I said. Ulta. Oh, you said Ulta. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you think you know that? I'll go. Um, or the concert. Isn't yeah. there like a festival called Ultra? Ultras? Yeah, Ultra. It's a EDM festival in Miami. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. I got yes. So and you so were at the section. I was looking at the outside, like not in. I didn't go inside. I was on the outside, and so I'm like bend it down, and I'm looking at stuff, and then some girl kind of comes over. She's like, "Hey," and I was like. Hey. And I thought she thinks like I'm stealing. I'm like, I swear I'm not stealing. I'm like look, literally looking at something. Mm, maybe stealing um, and she's too. like, no. Well, you're stealing? No. no. And she was like, I can't wait for this Saturday to be at the live show. And I was like, oh, that's so awesome. Her name was Yoseline. She works at the Ulta inside the Target in Alhambra. Oh, excuse me, in Pasadena. And she was like, yeah, you know, I try to get my friends to come with me, but no one wants to call off. I'm calling off. She's like, I'm going to go by myself. And I told her, come by yourself. Don't worry. Like, yes. everyone, like, taps in with each other. We're all having a vibe. And so I'm excited to see her. And she was cute, by the way. Ew. Ew. Um, and then I she was going at, alone. She don't have to go home alone, though. Stop. And then um, I was at Universal Studios. We went um, with the boys. And I had lost my wallet. So at the Super Nintendo ride. Typical, le so, typical you move. No, it's because I didn't want to leave in the stroller. You know how they have stroller parking? Mm. Stroller parking always scares the fuck out of me. Yes. Because it's literally like you just leave your stroller with all the shit in Unattended, there. Unattended, yeah. Yes. And just the honor system. Yes. <laughs> and you know people are not honorable. Yeah, yeah this ain't Japan. Don't and, then if you got like, <laughs> and then like Letty probably got a Louis Vuitton stroller. So. Yeah, so <laughs> we had the stroller. <laughs> and then I'm like, let me take my wallet. But yeah. then the boys had played with, like, we had passed by Jurassic, so they got, like, little dinosaurs. So they were having me hold their, I, had, I was just holding everything. Yeah, yeah, and then at, at Super Nintendo, they have, like, a hat on you. So, like, you're fiddling with the hat thing. And so I'm just holding a bunch of shit. When we get off, I just remember that I'm holding the 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 dinosaur and, like, all their shit. And the fucking wallet fell off. And the wallet had fallen off. Ooh. And then they had, they're like, okay, we have to wait till it cycles and check it. And they didn't find it. And they're like, come back in an hour. And I was like, dog. And then... Um, we were on the VIP tour, so they were like, just wait till guest relations because we have other we have other rides to take you on. And so I went to guest relations and I was just waiting there and waiting because you have to wait till they get everything from each ride and then send it up to Lost and Found, yeah. essentially. So I'm waiting and I'm just like chilling and I guess through the Lost and Found, like the outside could see inside. And so a girl comes in and she's like, hey, are you Letty? And I was like, yeah. And I didn't know she wanted to fight because she kind of was like, hey, is this you? Yeah. Um, and she's like, no, my husband saw you from outside and told me to come in and say hi. And that they're, it's Veronica and Jose. And like he came in. It's funny because he sent, sent his wife. Yeah. Go say hi to her. Go see if it's her. Go see if it's her. And so she said what's up to me. And then he was there too. So big up to you guys. I don't know how the fuck you saw through the fucking doors that it was me. Yeah, but it was crazy. really tight. It was cool. So I met, I met to a guy today at the gym. We're really? like working out right next to each other, and he, I, you know, I could feel like the he was doing. Yeah. He was like, I'm doing this workout like with the machine, mm -hmm. and he's doing this one. So I kind of like. Which one he, is he doing? He's doing like the one where he like works on this. So he's like oh. stretching it, but he's kind of like stretching it towards me. Pause. Okay. Pause. Okay. pause. Okay. So he okay. kind of was waiting for so me. Then to, you see what it do. So he's kind of waiting for me to finish my set, so he's mm -hmm. able to like stretch out his hand fully. Oh, got you. So we're like taking turns, and then he he was done, and he's like, "Hey, bro." But I had, like, my AirPods on, so I think he waited for me to finish my set. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, when you make eye contact with me, when he was like, hey, bro, I watched Brown back, bro. Congratulations on everything. That's fine. I didn't get his name. But shout out, bro. I always get their name. You have your notes app? I always write their name. Shout out, bro, app. from the gym. And then the other two people. Did you I met him. Name? I met him last night. I didn't. But they're coming to the live show. It was two girls. Fire. Her Her husband, I think her husband or her brother was like, we're bowling. And me, Danner, and all the homies, we happened to get the, the two bowling um, lanes right next to their lanes, and they're mm -hmm. with like a family and everything. And like, here's a, that's it, that's it. <laughs> but me and the homies are slapping each other, arguing yeah. about, 
all right, watch, bitch. You feel like I gotta buy the You're round? You're being you. Yeah, yes. we're with the homie. And then they're like, hey, bro, can we get a I was like, yeah, come on, let's get a picture. We took a picture. The little niece was there. I took high fives. And they're like, we're going on Saturday. I also didn't get the name. I'm fucking terrible. But I'm like, I'm everybody's dad. So they're like, hey, fool, we're gonna get this. I'm like, hey, hey, fool, we're gonna get this. So I'm like, trying to put my shoe on, the bowling shoe, so I don't slip. But yeah. shout out to them. They're gonna be at the live show. So. Big up to you guys, We're man. Excited. We're excited to see you guys. So that was dope. So I'm, yeah. That's what I'm so excited for, like, just to meet all the people, see all the people. It's a trip to me that I'm meeting people that are going to the live show. I can meet people that know who we are, yeah. right. but that are going to the live yeah. show. That yeah. shows me, like, motherfuckers are on it. Like, yeah. I love that shit. To see baby girl, y'all sitting in, and I told her, come through. We got you. Like, don't even worry about it. This shit's going to be turned. Like, yeah. She's a little baddie? Of course she's a baddie. I'm like baddie. I think she likes yeah. me. Uh, shout so out, I want to shout out to... Uh, Letty, her name was Letty. Oh, really? Yeah, I met her at um, the, like, we had a soccer, one of the -hmm. the family, shout out Matt and them. Oh, Um, the soccer, Emmy soccer. Yeah, Yeah, they had a party. Honestly, I don't remember what we were talking about because I got too lit, but I just know that she's a... Maximo feels bad that he got so drunk at the party. I got lit. Because he's like, they shouldn't see me like that. Because they're other parents. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Yeah. Like, were you... I don't remember what we talked about. Were you the only lit one? I don't remember. They're probably lit too, but he doesn't want to be in a space where he's that lit in front of like, it's just nah, different. I was super lit. Like, How'd you get su- so drunk? I don't know. I actually, I took a little, little shroomy. <laughs> no, you didn't. <laughs> <laughs> oh nice. my God. Yo, you were right. Mr. Mushy. So <laughs> was, it was a psychedelics. Oh, shit. oh yeah, I have a shout out. Um, shout out to. So shout, oh yeah, my bad. Shout no, out to shout out Vanessa. Shout out. Ray, both of us, everybody that was there. Amazing. I'm like, do not, I didn't get their name. But shout out to Bro at the oh Grove. Oh my goodness. I was shopping at bro, the I'm Nike fucking store. terrible. I swear to God, it was my fault. Yeah. That's my fault. And then he was just like, man, I, like, I fuck with you. I watch the show and all the stuff. That was that was hella cool. Um, also ran into um, somebody that watches the show at, at a bar the other day, too. Um, I don't get their names because. Oh, um, yeah, I just remember, too. Shout out uh, the homie Fate. I ran into him at Pins Bowling and he was at a company party. He's like, hey, Maxpo. He's like, Usually I don't go up to people, but I feel like I know you. And then he brought me yes. like five drinks in like 15 minutes. Whoa. And then his his company was leaving. So he filled up a to-go thing of food. Oh he's like, yeah, go, go, take this too. That's love. That's, that's fire. Love. Yeah, shout out Faye. So, yeah, so I, that's crazy that this time around, I met so many fucking people that are like, bro, we'll see you on Saturday, bro. Yeah. Like, And they're like, what's up with Lil Rob? Yeah. <laughs> is that for going to shake summer nights? They just kept asking me that. Is some he going to shake some? And no, no, is he going to shake nights. summer nights? Oh, I'm like, <laughs> is <laughs> he going to shake summer nights? Yeah, Little Rob shakes some, that's crazy. Crazy. But fool, that fool's like, hey, fool, I'm excited for Little Rob. We're at yeah. a bar getting drunk. I was at a little bar the other day, and yeah, the same thing. It was like, bro, they're like, Bro, we can't wait, bro. The wheelchair, we looked it up. Like, yeah, because a lot be of people don't know and do know about the wheelchair, which is a little trick. Right. But yeah, I, I just go like, what's your Western, bro? Like, main intersection. Literally right on the corner. Yes. I'm excited because this is turning into like an annual thing. Um, I haven't posted it yet, but I was going through all of our live shows and some even surprised. Like, I forgot the El Rey. Like, just looking at the backgrounds. Yeah. Like, last background, we had like the like downtown LA, mm-hmm. like yeah, cityscape. Yeah, the the, 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 the time before that. The El Rey, we had the picture of the of the blue wall. We yeah. had the the hundred episode in Boyle Heights. Yeah, we had yeah. the one where we're like the other los muertos vibes. But going back and seeing all that, like it's touching. Like yeah. it's like God damn. We've done and, a lot of monumental shit. For and you sure. guys have been there every step of the way, and it's cool to see. Like we love to see the first timers, and we love to see the ones that were there in the fucking one hundred and twenty. Uh, Max people one that we yes, had the yeah, very and, first and, live and, show. And we packed it out too 10. much to where like. Or twenty. Yeah, yeah, we we and we sold out like in two hours in an hour that maybe. Be yeah. so tight. That it's one true. that one was dope because that one where we we, we actually like had to believe and Letty was like, We got this, don't even try. Yeah. I know. I was like, this is easy, like we'll yeah. do this. That one low key to this day was still one of my like that shit was so dope. That one was that nice. That, was that, that first one. Because your moms were there, it was so intimate, all of that. Yeah. And and you know I love what? how we walked through the crowd to get to the front yeah, of the stage. That was tight. And you know what? That 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 one we've done we did downtown that, that's considered like almost East LA. Mm-hmm. We did we did Boyle Heights at mm-hmm. the Paramount, which was dope. Yeah. We did LA Live, the, the LA Los Angeles. Genova, we did the LA, LA. Mid City. Mid City. We and then now we're doing Koreatown, but it's also like a very legendary spot in Los Angeles. Yeah. That's so cool. And we're like Nah, fuck. if you guys have never been to the Wilton, once you get there, like we were tripped out. We, we did I was amazed. Through. I've never been there before. I've ever. been there, but like I haven't been there and really like 
inspected it, it. like yeah. really looked up at the walls and looked at around and all the scenery like while nobody's there and you're just like this is a fucking beautiful venue like, historic venue, historic. And it's historic like legit there's a plaque Yes. About like um, I don't know I don't remember exactly what piece of history it is, but it's like marked as a historic oh, like monument. That's yeah. so beautiful. And, and, and where I crashed my moped is literally around the corner You're from so there. Stupid. I swear to God, my homies were laughing that day. They're like, yeah. "Bro, that's gonna be." So sick. that's why you neither of you guys bring in any cualquiera, okay? Because it's historical. Yes. Yes. Also, shout bring- out Esther. And the Strata yes. Law Group. Yes. Man, thank you so much to Esther. Hell yeah. The Strata Law Group. Esther. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely shout out Esther they're, and Primo. They've uh, been holding us down. They've been the part time. of gang for a minute. Yeah. So we want to work together. If you have situations with any like accidents at work or personal accidents or cars or things like that, please go tap in with her. It's a lot of situations in this life where, um, especially as Latinos, you know, our status in this mm-hmm. country and this place, we. We get afraid about certain shit like that. And we no longer got to be afraid because we got somebody that's yep. to be your niece, your prima, your cousin, your tia. That it's definitely there to look out for you for your best interest, support you through every situation. Very intellectual, very yep. smart. Obviously, she has a fucking law group. Uh, Esther the lawyer and yeah. uh, Estrada law group. So make sure you guys oh, tap yeah. in with her. You know what I'm saying? If I fall and crack my head at a club, I'm calling Esther. I don't trust, <laughs> like, especially when it comes to lawyers and all this stuff, like, it's easy to feel the scam or feel the thing. Yes. Hester is legit. And you know what? She cares. Yeah. Yeah. Fucking love it's also thing. easy to feel intimidated by other people that you just feel like don't speak the same language as you or have the same, like, re- relatability. I'm literally, like, my, my youngest sister, Vanessa, um, she just got in a car accident. Like, mm-hmm. totaled her car. Four days after she got it. Fuck. And the first thing, like, when I, I heard about it, obviously I want to check if she's okay. But I'm telling her, like, I have a homegirl. Her name is Esther, the lawyer. You may have heard her on the podcast. And I'm like, I swear it's not an ad, but I want <laughs> you to be, like, taken care of, you know, mm-hmm. because there's certain parts that, like, aren't going to get covered. I, I literally was telling her, I said, you had a car and you were, you know, uh, driving to work. Now you have to pay for Ubers. I said, who's going to pay for that? Not the insurance company, mm-hmm. you know? And she was like, oh, I didn't even think about that. I'm like, yeah, that's where you can have an Esther come in and help you out with that. Wow, are we paralegals? That's crazy. Shout out Esther, man. Make sure you hit her up. Make sure. And for everyone coming to the live show, I can't wait. I'm excited. Again, I feel like this is going to be like a yearly thing. Yeah. And it's cool because it's like something to look forward to. Everything like I've been planning and like I'm so caught up with like life and work and home and everything. Mm. But I'm like the live shows this week. Like I get to like fucking be free. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah. And I feel that because I laid the law down in all my group chats. Don't call me this fucking week. Don't stretch me out on Saturday. Mm-hmm. Don't text me. Yeah. I already I told you guys Get what I together, need. Get it together, motherfuckers. Yeah. I already told you guys what I need. Don't call me for this. Don't do all of that. This is for me. This is for me. Don't stretch <laughs> me out this day. I told my mom and my sisters, don't call me. Don't do this. Mm-hmm. I'm going to give you a number in a group chat that you could hit up. Yeah. Don't you fucking call me. Don't you text yeah. me. Don't you ask me for this and this. I am on work mode. Unless you're going to come give me a back massage because <laughs> I'm stressed out or because I'm Leave working hard. Get the knots out the back. Mm-mm-mm. Don't fucking call me. Right. Yeah. That's how I'm feeling. That's the vibes. Real and shit. you guys, we have, if you guys couldn't get the meet and greets, we're going to have some dope ass merch. Shout out Angie. Yeah. Yes. We have some dope ass shits for your little crocky crocs. And we got some dope ass fucking toe bags. that. Are- yes. And last last um, live show, we gave away tickets to Best I mean, Mucho. We gave away tickets to like all the dopest concerts. So yes. hey, there might be some giveaways. Just That's saying. Right. We definitely are planning for some dope ass exactly. shit. And we we obviously announced that we have Lil Rob mm-hmm. coming. But we have other special she guests. She is not alone. We There's have other special guests that are coming through. Yeah. Some that we already confirmed. Some that are going to pop up last minute mm-hmm. and want to vibe with y'all. Because also, that is Los Angeles. Know, you're going to get your fucking money's worth. Yeah. We're going to put on a fucking show. We're you definitely all, extra. Tip us after. Yeah we're, we're, <laughs> we, yeah, we're definitely pulling all our favors in our context. Yeah. Literally. We're working OT. You know what I'm saying? It's going to be it's gonna be dope. There because, might be a fight happening. Like a... Yeah. Yeah, yeah. If I, let the, I think Letty's getting Ryan and mm-hmm. Oscar the Lawyer together. They're gonna, at the wheelchair, they're gonna it might spar. go down. Yeah, they might go spar. dude. Ah. I- <laughs> that was episode one nineteen. <laughs> we yeah. love you. And see you on Saturday. Please don't buy your shop. tickets. We'll see you guys. We're almost sold out this Saturday. Oh, too late. We'll see you on Thursday while you're watching this, but we'll also see you on Saturday. Have fucking fun. Get there early. Get a drink. Sit down. Uh, 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 uh. And make sure you guys sing Seven nights just sitting around And when the sun goes down I get ready to party Ah, hey the night the summer nights So it's about to be a movie We'll see you guys This has been Brown Bag Episode 119 Powered by D-Watches
Yeah.